Okay. Not double late. Oh, double late as in late for my 15 minutes late. Yeah, I guess so. Kind of. Not really, though. Not bad. I had to drink my booster juice, you know? Hi. Hey, David97. It's actually been months since I had a booster juice. Very nice. Probably the first BJ of the year. Thanks to the Prime lab tester. Hey, plant. <clears throat> Hello, everybody. It is climbing hours, yeah. Yeah. Probably gonna need a little bit of a warm-up, you know. We always start slow. But, uh, the plan today is to win. But my goal is to get to 5,000 meters... Let me do that. Um, I just join in on? Walkie. One year. Let's go spig loaf shake. Only using ten ropes. Peaks of your L E T S G O. Yeah. And I'm tempted to use a, a Sisyphus picture for my um live split but i don't know if they're gonna fit that well like if i just take Can't wait to get stressed watching you climb this mountain again if i just take the sisyphus mountain or the sisyphus pick you know is it gonna work because it's just not shaped well it's probably gonna be it's probably just gonna look weird and then i can crop it i might have to like rotate it and crop it really to make it good hello spiggy Love the streams when I get a uh, chance to watch nah, them. Nah, that's Keep good enough. What you're doing. That portrays <laughs> the image <laughs> perfectly fine. Yeah. Try not to fist bump a falling boulder again. Thanks, extra chunky. Thanks for the three months. Rat tail, thanks for the eight months. Chase Ski, thanks for eleven. Jax, thanks for six. Paimon, thanks for two months. I had a dream about falling down a mountain last night. Oh so no way! This is kind of ominous to me. Yeah, you're gonna fall down a mountain. Six months. Let's go. Excited for the stream. You got this. Thanks. I also believe that. Hey, Spiff and chat. But yeah, we're we're hoping to get to 5,000 meters to 10 ropes. Basically, that'll set us up 30 ropes for the sections that we haven't done. So we're really not gonna use ropes, except for there's a number of spots. Oh shit, what the timer guy, right? There's a number of spots where like I just don't want to do without a rope, and I think this is about 10. There's probably gonna be more that I don't feel like doing without a rope, but I can live. Wouldn't it make sense to use almost no ropes for the first half? Except spots that you normally have to try a couple of times? Yes, that's what I'm- that's what I just said. And that's about hey, Spade, ten. Already a year of loving your life but it's not even half. Videos. We want to get to 5,000 meters without using, um, many ropes. So that's like two-thirds. Today the only way is up. Yep. So true. Woohoo, 13 months. Thanks for all the content. It has helped me stay sane. The uh, second Peaks video is done. The one of about whatever that other mountain's called. Uh, something else. That video is done. I'm gonna make, I'm gonna post it tomorrow. Sleepy Coffee Cakes. 14 months. Can't wait for Holy you to shit. finally beat the mountain. How many your subs is that? I can't see because it's on what did I just join in bits. On? Is that 10? Hi, Spig. Currently at school. RN oh, Spig's this? badge, but have a great day. Thank you so much. You've gifted a lot recently. Thank you very much. Yeah, new video tomorrow, and then... Uh... <laughs> uh, it'll be a few days before the next one after tomorrow. be at least five days. Go check out the 
Where's the risk of rain music? Oh my gosh, I can't believe I got that. I wasn't ready for that at all. Not yet. It occurs that your PFP has a beard, but you haven't had one. Yeah, I stick with a very, very light stubble. You'd notice I look quite babyish if I totally shaved it off. Um, but no, I don't have a beard by any means. No. I have stubble. I don't really want to grow anything significant out. Happy birthday for real for real. But in some of my older videos, like I have noticeably more facial hair. Oh wow, it's been 16 months already. Uh... Time goes by fast, I swear. What? Oh yeah, and this one you go up to here, yeah. It's <laughs> You know you've done this mountain like a, a lot when you've basically, like, you recognize, I've recognized the first thousand meters of this thing or so. Which is just kind of ridiculous. It's like, oh yeah, 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 here. Just join in on walkies. 12 months, woohoo, big loaf shake. Nope. Six months. Also, you weren't lying when you said this was an indie masterpiece. It's been three days and I am on 30 plus hours KEKW. Jeez. Okay, wait. Guy Parrix, holy. Three miles backwards in the I, have, hill both ways. I have more than 30 hours in this game now, I think. But 30 hours in three days is... Well, that's, uh, that's like me when I'm really, really making a YouTube video. Like, really making a YouTube video. I don't really, like... You can do it. I... Oh, you know what? That's not true. I've played 30 hours of Lethal Company in three to three days. That's the last game that I, like, really intensely binged. But before that, I don't really ever... play games... that long, just game. Oh, that's not good. Oh, we are using up this icicle. Right. Can't believe it's been two years hoping for a win today. Yeah, me too. And up, oh, there we go. All right. <laughs> Loaf appearance prediction? Uh, Loaf, Loaf is currently banned. I might let her in later, but she is currently banned. Why, thank you. Thank you, beautiful. Oh, yeah. How is Loaf? <laughs> Can you close the door for now? Okay, thank you. Paige has brought my coffee. Paige appearance prediction? I doubt she'll appear again. We'll actually be able to leave our house today. So on Saturday, I believe it was Saturday. It started like nasty snowing here. Real nasty snowing. And we live on a corner. Thankfully, we don't have a driveway, so it's really not that bad of shoveling. I really can't complain that much without a driveway, but... We live on a corner, and I had a- I've had a couple hours of shoveling this weekend. I have played Dark Souls. I have a, uh, uh, two-hour glitchless Dark Souls 1 speedrun somewhere. Excuse me. Could have been so much better, too. I just fucked up. And then decided I didn't want to play Dark Souls anymore. <laughs> yeah, yeah, swinging on a dead body. Yeah, it's Richard. Chat, meet Richard. Our new piece of your chatters. And so truly begins Richard's demise with the first Richard reached. <laughs> There's a lot. <laughs> Yeah, not only do I know a lot about the first thousand meters of this, but so does chat. 
it's true. If they, if you are a frequent stream watcher, you've seen many Richards. It's funny though. Yes, the first Richard. <laughs> we are well acquainted. Yeah, no kidding. Uh, all right. Yeah. Okay. Nice. Yes, we are back to climbing the scary mountain. I guess if I don't really plan on taking multiple trips, I might as well use up these shortcut icicles. I heard you saw a lot of Richards in that museum in Iceland. <laughs> Richards, yeah. Yeah, that video, uh, <laughs> that, the second mountain, whatever video. Mountain Richard's demise. The Bulwark video has, like, it, it's about a 45 minute video. I think it has 15 minutes of penis museum conversation. <laughs> Actually insane how prevalent it is. Penis what now? Yeah, I'll just have to watch the video. Uh, I'll I'll give a, a TLDR for anybody curious because I'm not gonna we're not gonna do this again. Uh, me and Paige went to a penis museum in Iceland and I'm, and we talked about it. So because you couldn't stop yapping about it, yeah, there was so much to say. Got to get my heater going. My thingies are getting cold. There really was a lot to say. Uh, no, under, under. <clears throat> I remember. We're almost at the first ice wall. We're at like the, we're almost at the first like baby ice wall. Yeah. Uh, it, it's about all, all redacteds, all phallus or whatever you want to call them. But I mean, it's definitely got, it, it definitely goes for variety over just like, here's a bunch of cat. And now we're doing it again. <laughs> we can't <laughs> keep talking about this thing. Anyway. Back to the snow. Uh, a ton of snow snowed. And so me and Paige haven't been able to leave the house for a couple days. Just because our cars wouldn't make it out of, Ten on, months. Out of the street. Gym. And it's been like a part-time job helping people get unstuck. It's like, oh, David, there's another, you know... Poor loser in front of our house. Get the shovel. Let me go out there. Let me dig him out. Nine months, Greg. Is that really the direction? I don't remember this. Is this? Is this really? Over dirt? Okay, I might actually rope here. How are we? Yeah, sure. You and Paige, Paige are the pit crew? Yeah, true. Well, we're on a corner, and the one road got plowed, hey, the Steve, other one didn't. First time continuing my sub with Prime. So, I hope I did it right. It makes me really happy yeah, you that did, I just watch you on the regular Thanks now, the two months. either here or on VODs. You got this today. Plink Lover Onion, ah. thanks for nine months. Blanana, thanks for ten months. Uh, this road didn't get plowed, so people turn off the good, good road. And onto the other shitty road and just immediately get stuck. So we've taken a we've helped a lot of people out. There was somebody who didn't realize what four wheel drive was, but I think it was a company vehicle. Where to now? How many hours of peaks of yore do you think you have in VOD? Well, I, I wouldn't know. Well, I haven't played too much off stream. I've played like max two hours. Go. I love your content plank. 
Is this, oh, is this actually just like a rope jump? Yeah, it is, isn't it? This is like a mandatory rope. It's a crampon jump? How about no? <laughs> How about a rope jump? Someone use a snowboard to clear the entire court near your house? Yeah, courts would be kind of screwed for a little while. You'd have to resort to stuff like that. But as of this morning, uh, both roads have been cleared, so... As soon as me and Paige clear out our back alley a bit, we could leave the house. We walked, like... Since you don't stream Half an hour Wednesday to Subway yesterday. Now. On Wednesday, we wear plink lesbian pride. Yeah. I will not. I'll be going on my P.O. box Wednesday. So. Wait, do I still have this? No, I don't. So for anybody who sent me stuff, I know there's a few of you. I will be able to pick that up then. Yeah, I've retired from pit. Well, you never truly retire from pit crew. There's always going to be somebody who somehow manages to get stuck. Like, they take the widest turn known to humanity and go straight into the snowdrift. It is a frequent thing. A lot of people in my neighborhood, it's... What did I just join in on? Walking. Like, Yay, my their first time yesterday. seeing snow. Lot of new families from other countries in my neighborhood, so... <laughs> you can't blame them too much for having no idea what's coming. But I always recommend that they get winter tires. Because that's your first step in not getting annihilated. Yeah. I don't have snow tires, but I like to live on the edge. <laughs> just kidding. I just haven't bothered to. Paige does, though. So whenever we are entering Sketch Town, we, we just use Paige's vehicle. You should try out your Minecraft server for one. Many people have been active and would love to see you big loaf shake one quarter big loaf shake. Yeah, I actually uh, remembered. Almost half a year. Is it my Minecraft server still? I... I, and anyway, I have access to it at the very least. I don't even think I have ownership of it anymore. Um, yeah, I remember it existed when I logged on to Minecraft to play Blog Wars. It's like, what? <laughs> Astral Spiff server? Oh, yeah. Since when do you have a Minecraft server? I used it a year ago, and I used it two years ago. Ten years down the line, we will look back and think, this is the point where Spiff peaked. True. Like, is it is it still in my Discord? Because I was pretty sure it migrated elsewhere. It is? Okay. Yes, it's still here. Okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I don't really play Minecraft. Although. So I've mentioned my idea of uh, making a Minecraft series, trying to kill the Warden without looking anything up and understanding what the Warden is, where to find it, or anything like that. Uh, I don't know if I'll ever get around to doing it myself. However, John. <laughs> John FNAF, the guy I always try to get to do stuff with me. Uh, maybe I could convince him to do that with me. I want this company to sell pigs of your brand coffee. That would be good. For some reason, I thought you were going to say underwear. Yes, in reference to the GTFO sack. Uh, this mountain is called Solemn Tempest. It is truly the game's last mountain. 
Except for Space Mountain coming 2025. Or something. Force drawn into the two week Minecraft phase? Well, with both of our schedules, we're only really able to hang out every couple weeks max. So. It would be more like a Minecraft day every couple weeks, but yeah, that's a good idea. Space Mountain, do you get to meet Elon Musk? Holy shit. <laughs> He's at the top. You get a free Tesla. <laughs> Let's go one year. Okay, so I hate these jumps with a fiery passion. Um, but I don't need a rope. Went to Iceland so that he could get better at peaks of yore. But they're just so awkward. I really hate the angle. In 2025, we're going to climb a space elevator. Here we go again. Oh God, <laughs> yeah. No, I really don't like it. <laughs> uh, I I think I can rope it. It's just so ew. None of the jumps just line up with the natural law of the world. It's okay, chat. We didn't fall that far. <laughs> Trust me. If you thought that was a bad fall, you ain't seen shit. <laughs> what happened to the Security Breach multiplayer mod? Development got discontinued. Um, it never really reached a really cool point. I had a couple good streams with it. I feel like after every try and every climb, the name, The Solemn Tempest, feels more fitting. You cannot climb recklessly. You must take the challenge seriously. Steady yourself and climb. The bitch boy filter. What did I just join in on? Walking. Woohoo. 14 months. Love the streams and videos. Keep up the excellent work. Good egg pun, wild card. Thanks to 14 months. This stream is a sign you should go use your gym climbing membership? Yes. <laughs> you have a gym climbing membership. You should probably use it. Peaks of your thermos? <laughs> That's cool. I don't use thermoses. But, uh, that is cool. I would definitely get the coffee, though. That's a fun idea. I've actually been looking for a good brand of coffee. I haven't really settled on any. I if I could just jump to there. Yeah, I'll take it slow. True. If if Peaks of Your brand rope worked anything like it does in the game, it would be pretty damn good rope. No coffee is best coffee? Your opinion is wrong. Man, I had a sweet Twitter interaction a couple days ago, chat. Imagine that. A positive half a year. not only Love that you, but it was a positive Twitter interaction on FNAF where usually Madge is the first reaction to most things basically uh, if you saw the FNAF in real time demo that's been going around the jump scares are very unique Chica does like a spin uh, Bonnie, like, lifts his face. I, I think that's it. Anyway, somebody uh, took to Twitter with the Chica spin and was like, Yeah, I don't know if this is it. It's not very scary, you know? I think you should go back to the kitchen. Uh, just something along those lines. Keep cooking. Um, not very mean, but, like, obviously not a fan of it. And I ratioed the fuck out of them. It's like a four to one. I'll find it. So I said, 
You can see, yeah, okay, I said, yeah, no bad take. If you want regular lame jump scares, go play any game. They've all got them. Don't shut down the first time. People do cool stuff. <gasps> I want to see Chica do backflips before slapping the screen. Get out of here with the nonsense, okay? And then the original tweeter says, okay, we have our opinions. And then I said, thumbs up. Look at that positivity. Also, somebody made, somebody turned this into a Bonnie jump scare, and I really hope that it's added in. But, uh, yeah. Pretty, pretty sweet. Time. Too civil for Twitter? I mean, I know. I've heard a lot of good things about Top of the Morning Coffee Jack Septic Eyes brand. Yeah, as actually, as soon as I said I'm looking for coffee, I was immediately like, yeah, I, have, I haven't tried Top of the Morning. Yeah, I'd be down to try it. I don't super want to order coffee. I kind of just rather buy it at a store near me, but whatever. <clears throat> Yeah, I know, it's really wholesome. But I mean, at the same time, it's not like they could fight back. I, I didn't look at the likes just now, but it was something like 4,000 to 1,000, so... They would have had to know that they were outnumbered. Alright, that's it for this rope. I don't regret it. I hate that spot. That's two ropes, chat. We've used two ropes. As a FNAF fan, I am extremely excited for the real time FNAF. Oh, we gotta do it. We gotta do it. We gotta do it. We gotta do it. This, I always rope this. But I'm feeling spicy. Yeah, I have a pipe. Yeah, it gives me bonuses. Oh, let's go! <laughs> let's fucking go, Chad. What's up with the beeping sound when you get a notification? Uh, you're referring to my sub alerts? I don't know. One of them has beeps. Just comes with the sound file. Do you think you'll be able to do this ropeless someday? If I continued to play every couple days for a long time, yeah, I would. Yeah, you're right. But that's just the thing. I, I do not plan to slash want to do that. Is that a shortcut? No, it's just a required jump. You'd really think it was a shortcut. This is also kind of awkward, but let's see what's through this. I think I just, yeah. What How many coffees do you get in total? Because of, Peaks of your? how much I'm I've peak. collected. Peaks of my what? Oh, you are peak. Yeah, true. Because of how many collectibles I got, I have infinite coffee and chalk. <laughs> So annoying. I think it's the eight months peak. Peak of. I don't know. Human capability. Chalk would be useful here. Here's one of the rare spots in this mountain. Chalk's not that important here. But here, I'll use it now. Chalk up, and then boom. Aha, very nice. I can hold on to this hold as long as my heart desires. This is so nerve-wracking. I think part of the secret is to not get nervous, because as soon as you get nervous, your hands start getting sweaty. And when your hands start getting sweaty, it's all over. Then you slip off the mountain. Palms is sweaty. When I get sweaty, my guy in the game gets sweaty. What's PB? 5,000 meters. Which I can be proud of, I think. So far. 
Do I find this calming? No. But I do like getting high on the mountain. <laughs> it feels good to succeed. Three months W for me. Mm. Unfortunate jump, but whatever. So I do actually want a rope here, I think. But I knew I could do those couple jumps, yeah. Now I think I'll rope. Oh, why, David? You're fine. Because I'm afraid. <laughs> what did I just join in on? Walkies. Oh, a first-person climbing game. Yes. Chat, you'll never guess what my thumbnail is for the second peaks of your video. 17 months. Thank you again for watching my film yesterday. Oh, yeah, no I'd like fire to start creating more YouTube content, and I was wondering if you would ever consider making a playlist of the music you use in your videos, since I believe you said they don't get striked. That's not true. Um, well... I pay $12 a month to not get striked. <laughs> so I, I I do think Epidemic Sound is a fantastic service and would recommend it. It is not free. It's not Sisyphus. Oh, that's funny though. <laughs> no, no, no. It's very similar to the last piece. Oh, no. Bro, has the Have Mercy subscription? Yeah, pretty much. But I mean, it's I get access to their music. For $12. And then, okay, so the nice thing is, as well with epi Epidemic. You imagine Spigafus happy, getting high on a mountain. So let's say, just say, Fire and Art, you finish a big project and it has music from Epidemic. What you can do is pay for one month of Epidemic, post your video, it gets cleared. And then I I make sure of this, but I'm pretty sure you wouldn't have to continue to pay. I only pay because obviously I use their songs every month. But I'm pretty sure they operate on like a once it's clear, it's clear forever. Because when I edited for other people, I used it and I had to manually clear their videos. But once I did, it was good forever. So that's another nice thing about Epidemic. You really can use it for only $12 Whatever. Maybe even... No, probably $12. Uh, I wouldn't be the one to ask if this game's gonna come to console. I don't really know how controller controls would work. I'm sure they'd work okay. But yeah, I'm... I have never encountered an alternative to Epidemic that I would consider. It is kind of just the GOAT. Epidemic sponsor? Uh, I don't think they need to do sponsors. They have like a referral program that I just have never done. Or like if somebody signs up and says, yeah, Sploff sent me, I get like money off, but yeah, I have not done it. How's the copyright video going? Dude, I put it on me and Paige's calendar. Four days until I win the dispute by default. <laughs> Spiff national holiday. Getting his... Getting rights to his three-hour video back. So on the 9th... Uh, I should win by default. 
Unless that's when they decide to respond. <laughs> if they deny it, then it gets the process becomes a week longer. Yeah. Is there an end to this, or is it just randomly generated? There's an end. <laughs> it's just really fucking high. What did I just join in on? Walkies. Forty-two ropes. Thirteen months. Yeah, that's the you max. This mountain spig. Much love. I, uh, oh, yeah. Whoops. Oh, yeah, it's this way, I think. I only have 40. I'm missing one quest rope, pretty much. Or one quest rope pack, I guess. So... Really, is this the way up? Chat? No. I don't think it is. Uh, my GTFO video got copyright claimed fraudulently a month ago. Well, no, the day that it came out. So I haven't gotten a cent from it. Which is fairly catastrophic. But I should win. In, uh, in a bit here, so we'll be okay. I have not completed this mountain. Why would I be doing it again? <laughs> Bro is abusing the slurp juice? I'm not abusing. I, I earned this slurp juice. <laughs> it's mine to abuse. I guess I am abusing it, yeah. We all gotta rewatch it. Well, I should get all the revenue that has accrued. So don't feel any need to to watch it unless you are wanting to watch it. It's just been held until one of us wins, which is gonna be me. <laughs> yeah, if you want to watch it anyway, absolutely. <laughs> Tomorrow, I am like, first good chunk of time I'm able to put into the GTFO part two video. Maybe even this evening, depending on what page is up to. No, 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 no. We are doing that. There we go. Nasty. Good job, Connor. How high up am I? Let's find- Oh, I just checked, actually. I'm like 1,400 meters up. So... <laughs> Depending on who you ask. Not that high. Do you think the copyright claims on the GTFO videos will be an ongoing thing when you release more, or was it pretty much randomly targeted? Nah, it was random. Could happen to anything- any videos that had nothing to do with GTFO. One year ostrich spork. One year. It was weird timing. Glad it worked out. But a month prior, I had a takedown claim on the FNAF quiz video. It just happens. Copyright claim abuse until something changes is like literally just a problem every YouTuber has to deal with for no reason.
So yeah, every few months or so. Can you imagine so, how awful playing this in VR would be? Every few months or so, uh, you're gonna encounter theft. It's uh, it's too bad, but you know. How are you doing today? Just deal with it. I'm doing good. Richard, chat, this is the next Richard. Oh my gosh, I'm such a fan. <laughs> is it this ice block? I think so. I can't wait to get to the... The, like, 2,000 meter ice wall is the first, like, feels good man part of the climb. I can't wait to get there. And we will... Soon... Yeah, soon. Getting there. Yippee. Yippee is right. Yippee, Richard. <laughs> How many Richards are there? Dude, there's a lot. There's like a it was a it's a three or four Richard section at around five thousand meters. Pretty cool. Mm, I, you serious? If you are serious, it's not even a question. This is this is our fourth rope right here. Yeah, what the fuck is that? Ma mountain is uh, seven thousand five hundred meters. There we go. What's the lore behind Richard? Uh, they're all climbers that attempted this mountain and literally died. And yeah, that's it. <laughs> they're just still here. <laughs> and I use them. <laughs> I'm standing on the back of Richard to accomplish this climb. Mount Everest moment? Yeah, a little less. Everest doesn't <laughs> use the dead bodies to swing, but they do take advantage of them as markers, yes. Why is he so folded? Dude, if I was dead, I'd be folded. The zombie book series that I'm reading right now is getting a bit into like zombie mutations and i'm really hoping that they just go super ham with it and create like uh whatever the hell that game is zombies left for dead zombies yeah i feel like that'd be a funky way to spice things up uh it's called dust and decay Oh god. <laughs> I I have a couple zombie series. Rotten Ruin. Yeah, I think. Imagine reading a book. It's good for the brain. I spend so much time on my computer. It's it's and like the snow is nice outside. It's good for the brain. Rot and ruin, Chrome. Fun fact, there is about three tons of poop on Mount Everest. As you have discussed with shit rivers, poop doesn't go away when cold, so a large majority of the mountain is covered oh. in the waste of hikers. That's a really fun fact. Thanks, Turin. Thanks to the <laughs> new tier one, Becca. 
Becca Mello, and thanks to the new tier one, High Powered Waffle. Greffly Obby, thanks for 11 months. Frogs are great, thanks for the bits. Nako, thanks for 25 months. Ranch, thanks for the year. Uh, they recently passed a lot of forest hikers to take their poop back with them. Wow. It's like walking a dog, except you're the dog. <laughs> walking yourself. <laughs> no more stinking up the mountain. Why was Loaf banned from the room? Because it's a stress day. And Loaf is too distracting. She's so fuzzy. Stress day. How? Because I'm trying to climb a seven kilometer mountain. And I don't need a cat biting me halfway up. People saying you are eating. Spiff is hanging onto a dead body right now, Plink. Dead bodies are less gross than poop, change my mind. Especially skeleton dead bodies. But non believers need the loaf sabotage. <laughs> Don't worry, non believers have the spiff sabotage, which last I checked is considerably more potent. How do I know I'm not Richard? Spooky, scary skeleton. I'd like to think of like the last days that we've been on this mountain as dropping off Richards. Like, you know, I'm on dude number six or whatever. All right, we've reached the, the one third through the mountain ice wall. Uh, with four ropes, I think, used? That's, that's pretty nice. The absolute worst part of the climb is between, well, worst part up to about 5.5 kilometers that I'm aware of, is from about 3,000 meters to 4,000 meters. It is actually disgusting. In theory, with my pace, if I were to finish the mountain without falling, I don't know. Probably like three hours. You add in some falls, suddenly it's seven. World record's 16, but that is a very practiced individual who uses everything the game has to the best of its ability. The game's ability. Lowered it to 15. <laughs> Incredible. Yes, getting hit by rocks does, in fact, knock you backwards. So up here we have one of the hardest jumps. And it's not supposed to be punishing. But as we learned, I think, last time I streamed this game, uh, if you fall incorrectly, you can fall back to the bottom from here. So, I might rope it. It's these two jumps. Better safe than sorry? Yeah, but I have to make it to 5,000 meters with 30 ropes. That's my goal, so... I only... I only gonna let myself use five more ropes for the rest of the climb, pretty much. But this jump is pretty disgusting, yeah. Here, what I'll do is... I'll move the rope. What I'll do is... Rope here. Uh, 
Wait, when you remove a rope, oh, hold on, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Walkies. Take this one back, and then get back in this guy. Uh, I'll just. Take you back and replace it. There we go. What's stopping someone from infinite roping? Uh, running out of ropes. No, you don't get them back. Because. You can't recycle the bottom ropes because if you go down and get them, 19 months. then Climbing you've just Gober. gone back down. Yeah. And you have to climb back up. Because when this rope hits its max, I can't grab the rope and take it back. I have to release it from me and it's going to fall back down to here. So basically, you get 40 ropes, which provide safety for a small section. But you can use ropes to practice a jump until confident. Yes, that's the purpose of them. <laughs> this jump is act like it is the worst the big rock shows mercy today that I've death. seen in the mountain. It's just such a nasty jump. Basically, you have to go up. Maybe I can. You have to go up, and then you have to kick off the wall, spin around. And swing and grab it. Rope before jump. After jump, there. unrope and put new rope. Use new rope to get old rope. Rinse and repeat. I understand the concept of that, and I despise it. Um, but it doesn't quite work like that. Because... If you attach a rope and then go down to pick up an older rope, when you pick up the older rope, you'll become unattached from your new rope, which isn't necessarily that bad because your new rope will still be dangling down, but it does mean that you have to, like, jump off the cliff to collect it or to get back in it, which still poses a risk. So... I just, I wouldn't do that. It is not fun. Okay, and then this one. It also take one hell of a long time, yes. True, we could put on music now. We are high enough to be gaming. That fall is not bad because it's just. <laughs> okay, Noah. Are you telling me that if I look up. What do I even look up? I'm sure there's a ton of music in Baldur's Gate. Hello, Spig and Chat. Taco Boy here. <laughs> no endless rope, and yet I'm to believe that you're bringing a big gulp of coffee? Yes. Vote for Celeste Ost. We've already Celeste Osted. I'm fine with a bit of variety. 
We've Celeste Austed, we've Hollow Knight Austed, we've Risk of Rain, we've Rain Worlded, we've Marioed, we've zelda we've... We've been playing this game for a while. <laughs> I'm down with a bit of... Whatever. Uh, I think we have Doomed, actually. We, we Ultra Killed, that's close enough. But yeah, I do have the big gulp. <laughs> no, this is a banger. I'm not going to do single songs. Ah, we haven't done inscription. Ah! Vile! Gross! That is such a rope, it's not even funny. Hello, Spig and Chat. Taco Boy here. Ah, I accidentally forgot to say anything in my one year sublimat. But how are we all doing today? My birthday is in three days and I randomly got sick. I'm dying. Send help. <laughs> Dude, I just spit on my key. <laughs> Let me share an interesting story with y'all. I got peed on in kindergarten today. Being a teacher is full of wonders. <laughs> just hearing Taco Boy talk about getting sick with like the battle music in the background. I'm dying. <laughs> Uh, I hope you feel better soon. Sorry about laughing about you getting sick. Oh my gosh, I even got a little bit on my monitor. Will your Minecraft tournament be a vid? Yeah, it'll be a vid on the extras channel. Chat, you need to get over the size of the coffee supply. Yeah, I got infinite coffee. <laughs> You'll be okay. What about the Library of Rowena Ost? It's it's too late. We've committed to at least 20 minutes of Baldur's Gate. My sickness was very cinematic, I guess, Keck. Yeah, it was. Your guys. Yeah, he pulls the coffee out of the back rooms. That's it. There's actually an infinite supply of coffee in the back rooms, and he just no clips. His asshole is a portal to the back rooms, and he just digs into it and pulls out new coffee every time. Bet you wish you didn't know that. Too bad, you asked. That's not where I'm trying to go. Is that actually with? Oh, it's a double cramp jump. Yeah. I remember this. <laughs> Why is there a lick emote now? Jump! Jump, you son of a bitch. Bloodborne Ostwen. You know, Bloodborne, if I were to play another FromSoft game, it would be Bloodborne. Seems like quite the bang. <laughs> seems to be having a hard time with his jump. There we go. Not good, not good, not good. Ah, we gotta go back down. 
Yo, I got that gamer lean lean going on right now. <laughs> Why don't I drink coffee? Watch me. Me when I get a man of that ass coffee. Not cut not quite the reaction I thought that ass coffee was gonna get. Whoa, not the wind! That was insane! That fucking gust was unreal! Oh my gosh. Oh well. Not that big of a fall. That was a pretty crazy, uh... Wind gust, though. Hi, Spiff. Today's my birthday, and I'm very happy I get to spend it watching you tackle this mountain. You got this. Thanks, Tanami. I hope you have a good birthday. What am I doing? <sighs> yeah, true chat. Quit licking the mountain. You're gonna make it slippery. Jump is so gross. Is it the same music? <laughs> okay, let me. I think it ended. Let's just go to here. Let's just go to here. <laughs> it was the same song, you're right. <laughs> I can't believe more people didn't pick up on that. It was, I accidentally pressed on like a one hour version. There we go. That was so nice. Too bad I can't get that more often. To you. The king. Ah. I hope your streams have been going well. Thank you for the thousand bits. <laughs> we were stuck in the character creation screen? Yikes. There we go. Yeah, so we could always go back to old reliable chat. Terraria Calamity soundtrack. That really is old reliable of grinds.
Ah, uh, Stray. I've tried Stray. I've used some Stray music, actually. Stray has not a lot of, like, dedicated tracks. Stray's music is mostly, like, area music. And, you know, it's, it's good, but it's not that good for just listening. Nice jump. Feckin' climber man. You want to end up like Richard, don't you? Using the last of my bits for the month to humbly ask for the Cuphead Oss next. Uh, what of it? I guess not specific song, but like... Queen Cobra, can you give me a... a a playlist that lasts at least half an hour. I will give into your request. Been I've been learning a ton from watching you and your community. Nice. So to at arrow splash for being an amazing mod. Huh. <laughs> nice to you. <laughs> nice arrow splash. No, Connor. What even is Ghost Runner? Alright, sweet. <laughs> it's a game? Uh, hold on. I gotta open that link. This is 41 seconds. Hold on. Does it- this isn't a playlist. What did I just join in on? Walk Is it a playlist? Cause I think you just linked one song in the playlist. Or did I mess up? Yeah, okay, you got it. Sweet, thank you. After listening to some more high quality Baldur's Gate, we will, uh... Put on some top edge here. Thanks to you, I got air up, and I'm really starting to drink much less soda. Oh my gosh, are you real? Or are you a company plant? And it's very good to hear. I'm glad that it's helped you. Uh, plant. Plant, are you paying attention, plant? I asked for the links. Cat jams are primed for <laughs> company plant. <laughs> yeah. What do I need there? There I need this. Ah. There. Look, there's multiple plants. Uh, there is kind of a save and quit feature. You get one save. Uh, it, it is currently bugged, though, <laughs> so currently, no, there isn't really a save and quit feature. There's supposed to be, though.
you do. <laughs> yeah, the bug was that all ropes don't save. Which wouldn't hurt me that much now, because if I fall 3,000 meters, I'm basically going to restart anyway, but... Um, it certainly did hurt me my first time climbing. I, I was not happy about that at all. Go to the top of the rocks, you get a more downwards trajectory. Well, I don't know what quite what you meant, but it didn't work. I've done this jump before. I can do it again. What does the hot steamy stuff do? You see a bit of oomph. Uh, no, I haven't made this jump yet today. Just kidding. <laughs> oh, you know what? I have made the jump. Because this is where I fell. Yeah, I got gusted. By Richard. I was summoned by the other guy the first work for. Sadly, I can't stay because Twitch doesn't work well when I have no power K-E-K-W. Yeah, I can't imagine it would. Good luck with your power, Hero Splash. I really want to reach a rock. I don't like just releasing off Richard like this. Please. It's windy. Uh... Hate, 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 hate. I need, be, I need a bit more silly funny. <laughs> there we go. I didn't press play all the first time. Yeah, if you can't see the cat stuff, it's because you don't have the browser extension. This is the menu music? Well, it'll pass. It's a playlist. But thank you for telling me, I do. I do need to be told that. If it doesn't pass in a while, we'll know something's up. Hmm.
Come on. Trombone noise. B R R R R R R A A A R A R. Yep. Yeah, trombone done right is is pretty pretty unreal. Righty now. If we fall, we swing to that cave, chat. Or we soon to swing to that wall cave. What is bro yapping about? Um, the circle in the left happens with these type of rocks. And instead of having like limited grip per rock, you have limited grip between all of them. So I'll fall off these rocks if that circle gets empty. That's why we don't let that happen. A lot of places, like, it's surprising how quick Canada gets excluded from shipping and stuff. Like, it can Canada is excluded from a lot of things, given... Canada is excluded from a surprisingly large number of things, given how similar it is to the States. And so, smaller companies... Just don't bother shipping to Canada because it's not worth it. For whatever reason. Businessy, 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 businessy. Like the other thing, I don't, I don't know why, but the other thing that immediately comes to mind with Canada getting excluded from stuff is you can't make money from TikTok in Canada. You could get a million billion views as a Canadian on TikTok and not get anything from TikTok. Uh, for Canadian TikTokers who make a living on TikTok, I think it would be only sponsors. What? Why? Well, exactly. Why? I don't know. Um, Canada's excluded from the creator, whatever, creator program. Now, it, mind you, it doesn't have a ton of countries, but it has, like, Ireland, and not Canada. Could they VPN? No. Doesn't work like that. <laughs> Ireland slander? Look, in terms of, like... TikTok priority? I place Ireland and Canada fairly closely, I think. Canada zip codes? Oh, hey, speaking of Canada zip codes, I accidentally kind of doxed myself in the most recent video. 26 months. I just got a flashback on Snapchat of me watching your stream two years ago today, lol. Um, I won't say where, but my postal code is shown. Or at least you'd think it was shown. But it's actually wrong. Um, so I will be leaving it up. It was like a Google autofill thing. 
and it just put in the wrong postal code. Surely it's still in here? So is my P.O. Box, so... It's no nearer than my P.O. Box. Where they only accept zip codes, but they say they ship to Canada? Yeah. I'm just gonna rip. Sure it's wrong? You're welcome. Well, okay, so it is wrong, yes. But it also only shows the first three digits. So I looked up what that was, and it's wrong. But even then, let's say those first three digits were right. It's an area of about 30,000 people. So, even if it were right, which it's not, I'm, I'm not too worried about it. <laughs> yeah, you can sure me all you want. Doesn't really matter if you believe me or not. But uh, that was unfortunate, for sure. <laughs> How many of those 30,000 are named David? True. Maybe none of them, because I don't live in that area. How far up am I? That's a good question. David Naked Man. You'd be easy to find as Spliff with such a unique first name, smiley face. Astral Spliff? Thanks for the new sub. This timer is... Just today, yeah. Ah! Chad, who remembers this chasm? We've, uh, we've fallen out of this chasm a number of times. <laughs> oh my gosh, you're right! The HP sponsor rant chasm! Yeah, how much I hate cha HP. My spreadsheet for clown has gotten a bit intense. What? What sort of clown spreadsheet are you making? Uh, I had booster juice. Slash, still having it. Hmm. 
We can't get a good footing there. What? Maybe we can. You know, Connor talked about the Daco quiz. That was my suggestion. Now I've been asked to compile all the times you've heard the voice line from the quiz and wanted to go overboard and make a worthy spreadsheet of info for you in chat. Oh my gosh. I can't imagine I've heard the voice line more than a couple times. Connor, I can't believe you're forcing Day Love Bunny to do this. Hey, by the way, what's Luna Mlemming? in that video. Cat paste. What the hell is that? Oh my god, they're making paste out of cats? They blam. <laughs> Chat, we are almost entering the worst section of the climb. Thirteen months strong. That I've seen. Big is streaming big spas. Look at the bottom, and I'll be right back. I gotta use the washroom.
That last nice trombone time was a good song for like montaging getting up to this point, Connor. Though I'll, I'll send you plenty of good musics for montaging. What did I just join in on? My door? <laughs> New video was very fun. Will the bit of loaf dancing on your lap become an emote? Oh. Big loaf feeling. Guess it's not a bad idea, is it? Didn't even think of that. But we do have 40 animated emote slots somehow, so. Can't do montages? Literally just speed up the footage, Connor. This music screams 300%. When I say montage, I mean video entirely supported by the music. You are so capable of that, I believe. But yeah, this is the worst. Worst. This is the worst. This part of the climb makes me cry inside. So we got that thing. Is this day three or four? Hmm, maybe five. I don't know. They all seem to blend in. <laughs> Connor, just say no. Yeah, I mean... The cat paste dupe snack is called Tiru and is very popular with cat owners in Japan. Mm. You should get loaf some and see if she will. Oh, she would definitely. <laughs> she would definitely malem. In fact, this song is sung by a woman? Nice. Plink Vibe has been added to the chat. Excellent. believe you understand the situation. The situation is Giga Chad gameplay only. Bringing 40 ropes to the mountaintop? Yeah, not 40, Wahoo. though. No, I like the peace and serene music while doing the scary part. This may be the face of someone who is calm, but I promise I am quivering on the inside. <laughs> I fucking love that cat.
Who was it recently? Oh, yeah, no, I already talked about that. Rating Smallant and having him ask if this is like getting over it and all of you saying yes made me die a bit inside. But I suppose that's life. Oh my gosh! I just let go of the wrong finger! Ooh, well. We, at least we have this thing. Flop, can I request you check out the Outer Wilds off next? It's good vibes and fits the Sisyphus theme if you've played the game. I haven't played the game though. So, where does this thing lead? Ah, it's so disgusting. Can you not get to anywhere better off of it? Damn. Oh well. Back to the chasm. Nah, it's such a sad way to... No, not a big fall. Not a big fall. Get over it. It's just unfortunate. A good thing about falling so much is that you'll be able to add more parts to your let's play. Band. What did I just join in on? Walking. <laughs> yeah, mods killed that guy. <clears throat> yeah, true. I never manually post put ads in my videos. I just let it go automatically. But for every let's play comment, one more mid roll gets added. <laughs> you need to have a Markiplier temper tantrum to keep the viewers interested. The same about them. Just got here. Are we peeking? <laughs> yes. Imagine if the game just started with this mountain. Just like, okay. <laughs> Have at her. <laughs> then it would be... A rage game. Also just stupidly hard. You get to learn everything. Gotta love the one-legged jump! Let's go!
I wouldn't be able to get past the first part. Nobody really would, I mean. I couldn't, and I have beaten every mountain up to it. In tough moments like this, I remember what a random chatter said in a drunken stupor. One would imagine Spiffice is happy. Drunken stupor? That's just what my chat says normally. Cipherous sane. Thanks for the 200 bits. Reverse psychology. We spam. Let's play comments. So you get tons of money. Not what I'm going for. And actually, <laughs> if I put that many mid rolls in a video, revenue would go down because people wouldn't watch. Eh? Currently 100%ing Twilight Princess with your Plank file? I thought about playing Twilight Princess again today. Neato. Love that game. God, I started doing some really goofy idea with Twilight Princess on stream a couple years ago. I never continued. I forget what it was. It was like put on a shirt every death or something really dumb. I don't know. It was one of those. Where you go like, oh, I see. My content creator is fresh out of ideas. My favorite Let's Play streamer is finally gonna beat this mountain today. Prage, Prage. Yeah, the opposite of strip poker, yeah. <laughs> rock bottom? I wouldn't call that quite rock bottom. Knew we would make a fire stream <laughs> if you just put on a whole bunch of shirts. Content starved creators. Yeah, rock bottom is reacting. Yeah. Hi, Spin. My boyfriend Ruben wanted to say hi to you. Three. Hello, Ruben. Thanks to the tuner bits, Becca. After the sub, thank you very much. This mountain, but every 100 meters is another shirt. 100 meters? Or 100 meters fallen? Hell no. We'll already be at like 15 shirts. I might get claustrophobic if I put on that many shirts. My best piece of content like that that I ever made. I still think this is one of the true, the few truly cool things I did with Sea of Thieves. was when I put on socks over my hands for like donation incentives and just played the game with like basically two big fingers. I thought that was actually good content. Oh, 
Oh. Oh. Not the icicle section, man. It's so nasty. Back to the chasm. Hi, Spig. How is your day finally eight months? Very good. It doesn't feel good to be in the chasm, but man, is that ice... Icicle plays terrible. Five mobs, let's go. Good luck, Spliff. And the problem, chat... Is that I don't want a rope yet. There. Because there's a good section of that icicle section without anything to land on. So I don't want to rope until I'm past that. There's no point. We'll rope when we're actually in danger. Chaos mod socked up. <laughs> what? I don't really plan on doing any more socked up content. Yet, I guess. But I do think it's a fun idea. <laughs> Looks like I am getting the popcorn. <laughs> so if I think Next challenge should be rolling a big rock up a hill. I think somebody's done that before. Wouldn't really be unique content. Suggestion for PVZ soundtrack next. It's an hour long for the full OST. PVZ3 released recently and I'm still grieving how bad it is despite being so visually pretty. Like 2D PVZ3? Or like Garden Warfare? Did like an actual PVZ? What? Why is it bad? That sounds so good. Yeah, Garden River is pretty good. I played with my nephews a bit. Monetized mobile game. PVZ2 is... I would say it's pretty good. Does it have, like, energy? Oh god, no. That's, like, number one worst phone game mechanic. Big win is poppy blindfolded jumpless while playing peaks of yore with your feet only. You're out of gasoline. But wait! For only $9.99. You can have triple the gasoline regeneration. That's really shitty. <laughs> what am I listening to? Oh yeah, get your cat vibes or whatever that emote's called, Chad. Plink vibe, sorry. P 
BVZ2 and its premium plants. I played it a bit. I remember it being pretty good. As a free-to-play person. But as a general rule, I did. I made it one year. Can we get hearts and chat for Spiff? Like I'm assuming, less than three. PVZ three is free and has a really nasty monetization model. It's just so much better to just like pay a couple dollars and not have any of the bullshit. I can't believe EA is still doing that. I thought they learned from Battlefront. <sighs> For some reason that jump went really poorly. I don't know why. I gotta focus up and stop plink vibing. We have to decide if we're gonna coffee this or rope it. No. Ah! I'm so sick of missing this jump, but I don't wanna rope it. We don't have to, it's not that hard of a jump. VOD viewers skip one hour. <laughs> oh, I just... <laughs> Shit. I gotta change that. Hold on. I just screenshot. I have a screenshot hotkey macro for my mouse. And it was on. <laughs> Do I have? I don't know. Some functional but shit Logitech mouse. Oh my gosh, we're back to here. Okay, fine, I'll rope that jump. It is, um. It has earned it.
We do still have three ropes to use before I said I don't want to use any more, but I might end up using a couple. Past that as well. No, I didn't see the last Game Theory video on FNAF, but... <laughs> I know they referred to Indigo Park as a game oversaturating the market. And Mason, with tears in his eyes, celebrated that MadPat mentioned the game. Like, you know, it's, it's too bad that he mentioned it in a negative light, <laughs> but at least he mentioned it. I can't watch this RN, but I just wanted to come and say hi. Hello. Chat, make sure to take your meds and drink your water and eat food. Thanks, Jellyfish. Jellyfish Dust, thanks for seven months. I hope you have a good rest of your day. Yeah, but congrats to Mason anyway. Well, that's pretty much how he took it as well. Like he put, MatPat put Indigo Park with Muzzy. <laughs> you hate to see it. <laughs> yeah, Oof is right. But I, no fault to MatPat, because he hasn't, at least Muzzy has a finished game, so. I'm sure if he comes out with a banger and MatPat plays it, he'll take back the Muzzy comparison. It does look good, yeah. I have faith in Mason. <laughs> Mazel one, Wendigo Park zero. Who's Muzzy? You don't even. You really don't have to know. Absolutely, there's. Yeah. It's okay. Here's my height in PBs. Today is 3100 so far. Have I done bouldering yet? Yes. Actual bouldering? I mean, I te guess technically I have done actual bouldering, but no, obviously we're talking about the video game. Yeah, bouldering is, is much earlier than this. If you're, uh, somebody who's just playing this game and looking on Twitch. Hey chat, do we got anybody else streaming this game today? No, no, I'm okay. Three people. Oh my gosh, it's spreading the sickness. The peaks of your mom's sickness. Are any of them on this? No way, I'm at the top of the peaks of your streaming category. No shot. What did I just join in on? Walk. Peaks of your mom. Thanks for the three months, Box Kimchi. 
One of them is titled Torture? Maybe, maybe, they, maybe they are on this mountain then. Oh my gosh. Yeah, so we we're kind of joking like the DLC could be like depths of yore and it would be like cave climbing or something. And then we'd have peaks of your mom. <laughs> And depth of your dad. I don't know why I think that's so funny that I do. This is like the fifth time I've heard a peak of your mom joke. <laughs> Bet you haven't heard that many depths of your dad jokes, though. Holy shit, are we back? So that's it, Chad. That's the last rope that we're allowed to use. I might go over that. If I get to 5,000 meters with 28 ropes, you won't see any tears from me. And then he gets it. No way. Damn right I've still got 30 ropes. I'm a hard-working climber in these Scottish parts. Yar. <laughs> it's a pirate noise. I'm sure there's been Scottish pirates. What is this old Disney? <laughs> it's Cuphead, all right? I'll switch it soon. Are you Scottish or a really blase Blackbeard? Scottish. Trying to trace my family history is awkward. I mean, if there are Saskatchewan pirates, there are probably Scottish Exactly, pirates. yeah. Cuz like I've got some matey. Okay. That's indigenous and French. All right. Dad's side. The oldest known ancestor we know because he like helped contribute to maps of Saskatchewan. Very exciting. I'm that pure Irish white heritage. I can't tan. <laughs> Feel bad. But, like, if you try to go past that... Wait, 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 wait. I gotta figure out what's going on here. It, it, we just kind of disappear into Europe. It's like, maybe Scottish, maybe German, maybe, like... Some of those other countries that are over there, <laughs> to the right. Uh, it's pretty much over as soon as you start going old, older than 100 years. Because, like, mom's side, simple. You trace it back to France, coming to North America, and then being shoved up to Quebec, and then going west. And then you add some indigenous people there, too. That's my mom's side. That's, like, all Canadians? Literally, yes. I guess the only thing that separates me is that I do have indigenous. 
But then you go back further from there, it's it's all over. My mom's side is... <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> like, old trade routes or something. <laughs> What's in the rectangle? Not the rectangle itself. Um, but yeah. Hold on, let me look up a European map. Because there's like that one country that I think our last name might be based from. LMAO. I've got a family tree that's just farmers all the way back to like 1600 somewhere. Well, I mean, everybody goes back to farmers eventually, I think. I, <laughs> I think our last name comes from here. Latvia, I think. So, you know. Somewhere around here. <laughs> I'm not going to say what my last name is. <laughs> Naked Man does sound Latvian? Yeah, you're right. Yay, but it's only my father <laughs> and uncles that didn't inherit the farm. Oh, I see what you mean. Yeah, okay, fair enough. Where does it even come from? Oh, yeah, I was talking about Scottish. Yeah, and we've a lot of red hair in our family, too. Like, if I grew up my beard, it's actually quite red. That's kind of Scottish. -y. Chat weekend docs by figuring out who drew the Saskatchewan <laughs> rectangle. No, my ancestor did not draw the Saskatchewan. Maybe he did. You know what? Maybe he did. I don't actually know 100%. I'm not redhead, no. I just have red facial hair. My brother is redhead, though. Um, Dude, I knew somebody who played the bagpipe. I could hear him down the street. What did I want to switch this to? I mean, there's Terraria. Yeah, let's do it. I, I want to hear it. been too long Looks like somebody's going out. Hold on. What's up? Hey. All right. Uh, bread, please. Yes. Oh yeah, if you can make it, that'd be cool. Yep. Love you too. Have fun. All right, chat. The cat is in. Hey. We'll see if she comes up. Probably will. Annoying loaf. Okay. Okay, she's coming up now. Alright. Hold the phone, loaf. 
Come on up. You will be my towel stand. Hello, great to see you after your vacation. As a natural climber, I have no doubt you'll make it to the top of the mountain in no time. Good luck. Big loaf shakes, big loaf shakes, big loaf shakes, big loaf shakes, big loaf shake. Loaf says thanks. What are you doing, Scottish man? Do not pull that shit. What? All right, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it. Let me up. Why wouldn't you jump, Scottish man? Leap. Good rope, Loaf. Good rope. Well, 
Love's been unbanned because Paige is going out. Flying Gabriella, thanks for the raid. How did I just get this jump? It would be a swing. Just big, I reached 5,800, 5, then accidentally quit when taking a break. It's okay, if you did it once, you can do it again. I too have not reached that height, just kidding. I've been close. Oh yeah, now it's down actually. Okay. Loaf is comfy. Back to Sploff Cam. Don't worry about pronouncing my name right. Hey, look a distraction. Suspect today. Loaf, you are not permitted to interact with the mouse. I will ban you. You're on thin ice, Loaf. If I still had that hotkey, I would have just taken another screenshot. When I squeeze my mouse, sometimes I accidentally press my thumb buttons. Using the safety harness? No. Never have. Don't even really know what it does. Imagine free climbing 8,000 meters, yeah. Not quite almost at PB, but I do like that mindset.
The three thousands are real nasty. Almost all the way through the three thousands. Come on, I know you can reach that. Four thousand to five hundred was happiness. Hopefully, the three thousand to four hundred is the worst in the climb, but. I'm not holding my breath. But yeah, 4,000 to 500 was super feels good, man. above that ice wall? I kind of forgot about it. So I should stop roping as soon as we are. Hmm. Is subscribing a one-time purchase or is it a subscription? You'll never guess, but you know, valid question. Uh, no, it's a subscription. Stuff like bits are a uh, one-time purchase. Okay, am I above that ice wall? I I don't I don't remember where I am. And it's making me, you know, slightly spooked. A little bit on edge, you could say. Oh yes, I am now above the ice wall because that's the way, that way down is the recovery position. If you mess up and land on the ice wall, yeah. So now I am above the ice wall. So we actually have a small moment of peace, but this very quickly leaves the ice wall. God damn it, not this ice shit again. It's a very short period of peace. Yes, yeah, sorry, pirate. Sorry, pirate. This. Not a lot of variety in your art recently. In my content, I mean. I'm at like. 3.5 thousand meters up. It's more fun to check on less occasions because then it feels better. If I check every 10 horizontal meters, you know? It doesn't feel very good. Because, yeah, I'm not going up. <laughs> This is, uh, this is what you call a horizontal. Height check. Just me, but my feet sweat so much while playing this game. Deep breath. Interesting. Look down and you'll be fine. I uh
Interesting. That doesn't happen to me. But my hands do, so. Here we sit, chat! On the precipice! Yeah, it's my first BJ of the year. The precipice of making it past the worst part of the climb so far. Up a Twitch highlight. <laughs> I would have landed on the ice wall. No, no, not the Twitch highlight. Anything but becoming a Twitch highlight. Ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> Classic fall. Classic chat. It's okay, we've done this one a few times. This was actually the first time, this fall, was the first time I saw a whole bunch of Sisyphuses in chat. This is, this is a pretty common fall spot. That, uh, that ice wall is just an excuse to give the player a bunch of bullshit jumps. And then see, we're back. Oh, not quite. Really? You gotta go this far out? Gosh, that's so bad. Do you really? Yeah, you must. Really? Yeah, okay. It'd be so goofy if the last like 500 meters was just a shitload of seagulls. Yeah, seagulls at the top of Everest, guys. That makes sense. <laughs> You've. Oh my gosh. That was a crazy bounce. You've overcome everything I've thrown at you. But can you overcome the goal? What do seagulls do? They sit on a perch, and if you knock them off, then they hunt after you and, like, release your hands from holds, run into you and stuff. Uh, yeah, you can give them a whooping, yeah. But you can't, like, execute them. Something. Here we go again. Well, that was better than last time. My neck's itchy. Ah. Ah. I've got to scratch. I've got to itch. Lolf, I request your assistance.
All right, this jump sucks. Like it really does suck. Instead of gulls at the top, it'll be a bunch of snow loaves who hide in the crevices and try to paw at your hand. Trust. I 100% believe you. Is this Terraria? Yeah, okay, no. <laughs> How the fuck did we get the Halo? <laughs> Alright, well. Maybe Halo knew something that I didn't. No, this is Patrick. Because <laughs> I know that Terraria Calamity playlist is hella long. So there's absolutely no reason we should have gotten the Halo swap. How did we get here? How did I get 53 minutes into a, a Halo? I literally clicked a playlist. And it just gave up. I'm continuing the Terraria Calamity chat. Is it a YouTube auto mix playlist? Oh, I don't think so. Get your arm out of the way, I'm trying to see.
Gotta be fucking with me, man. I need to rope this. <sighs> Getting to 5,000 meters with 30 ropes is not going so hot, chat. I, I don't even know. Oh, you know what? <sighs> yeah. Okay, I refuse to go under 20. I refuse. I'm gonna try and get this rope to work for this jump as well. I think it will. But these are two, both quite nasty, so. Okay. Well, sure. Cannot wait for the new marathon. <laughs> oh, we I did feel the rope cap out a bit there. Well, we can do that thing that I talked about. It has its niche uses, I think. Why yes, the thing? Oh, you're about to find out. Popping, so to speak. A very dangerous but potentially useful strat. Bit lower in coffee. Theoretically, you could constantly do that and never run out of rope. Yep, but it would be insanely slow and dangerous. Because you're basically flinging yourself away from the mountain. And if you miss the grab rot rope prompt, it's not uh, all that different from just feckin' doing the jumps. Yeah, and it's not always doable because of horizontal movement. That's true. Yeah.
You do the exact thing with safety harness, just no disconnects, I see. So I guess, yeah, that's the strat if you had safety harness then, probably. <laughs> Got him. Imagine doing that jump IRL chat. Oh. So yeah, now because that was very horizontal movement, I can't just place a rope now and go get the other one, really. At least not without a huge pain in my ass. No, and then I... Yeah, it wouldn't work. It wouldn't work. It wouldn't work. How goes it? David, you should play this game. And you should do this mountain. It's actually really, really, really fun and rewarding. And I shit you not. It is a lot of fun. And I mean, worst case scenario, you, you just... You can bow out of this one. <laughs> this one's a bit of a beast, not gonna lie. But you get to call yourself Certified Sisyphus if you beat it. You get the chat Sisyphus achievement. And that's worth every second. The game's called Peaks of Yore. You can also see it on the stream. If you just like tap the screen. If you're on PC, it's even more obvious. Terraria. I told Paige, today is a big day. I'm going to be climbing for a long time. That's what I plan on doing, chat. A long day of climbing. Good morning. Good morning. Long day at the office today. Gotta climb a 7,500 meter mountain. Fucking do it, David. Do it. Do it. Well, have somebody to raid if you do it. That'll be nice. Okay, wait. Does chalk apply to these rocks? No. Shit, it doesn't. Not that, I mean, we can just, just lock in. How high? High. When Sisyphus says climb, I say, <laughs> how high? This is a rope. I despise angles like these. Uh, no, game's not expensive. It's $20. That's not expensive. Not everybody can afford that, but it's not an expensive game. <laughs> really? Only $20? It, it, you're subbed for like a year. You could just not sub and buy this game. So yeah, only $20.
Oh, shit. That, that was the big fuck up, chat. That was the big fuck up. We are going nowhere good. I think we might be going back to the bottom, actually. Slow it down! I keep thinking you're saying syphilis. We are going back to the bottom. It's good news, chat. We get to recover more ropes. Surely I have to be a hold somewhere along here. Oh, yeah, here we go. There we go. Oh, I almost caught myself before we hit the bottom chat. <sighs> what did I just join in on? Walkies. Connor gonna be crying in Premiere Pro. He's fine. <laughs> He's fine. He must... Connor is also Sisyphus chat. He thinks he's gonna finish editing. Oh, back to the oh. bottom. He thinks he could finish editing. Restart to get ropes back. Uh, no, I think I can just pick up ropes on the way up. Don't worry, you'll get it next time, Spig Non-Believer Stunk. How far did I fall? Four thousand meters. Don't worry, I, Dr. Ice. I've already put like 20 hours into this level. I'm aware that you fall. I am aware. This is no longer to ter Terraria. It's your first time seeing the bottom of the mountain? It's your last time seeing the bottom of the mountain. Yeah, this is Mario Galaxy. Yeah, you got it. How'd you know? Somebody completed... I don't actually know all the details, but... The first, like... No-hit, glitchless... Ocarina of Time run? Or something? Something along those lines recently? And it took a month. Whenever I do something like this, and you know, we lose three hours. Yeah. That's okay. Majora's Mask? Yeah, okay. Oh, crap. <laughs> okay.
Up. Not the bottom. What did I just join in on? Walkies. I shall carry on your legacy, brother. <laughs> <laughs> ah! Hey, not the bottom. Oh, oh, oh! That doesn't count. I'm con technically connected. <laughs> what did I just join in on? Walkies. One must imagine Sisyphus happy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In your next VR game or stream, can you dress up and act as Gollum Wildering? Always found VR gamers looking like Gollums with how they move. Dress up like Gollum. Perhaps those new drivers will help the climb copium. Was there like a driver update notification? I see. So like, wear nothing but a loincloth. I didn't know that. <laughs> I don't know if that was intentional or not. You've summoned the great bulwark of the north. Godspeed on your next adventure. The great dickening of the double north. Ah, crap. I really used and abused these icicle guys. Didn't really intend on coming back. Oh, well. Scoot, please.
months already. Time flies like an arrow and flies like a banana. <laughs> yeah, flies do love bananas, you're right. Thanks for the 18 months, Tabula. The icicles can fall, yeah, just that specific type of icicle. Yeah, apparently I missed uh, a version of Solemn Tempest where the wind was really bad. Not upset about missing out on that experience. Hey, man. Sorry, love. My whistling woke her up. that a dead body? Uh, new chatter, meet Richard. Richard, meet new chatter. I gotta... Uh, I gotta go use the washroom. one has awoken from her deep slumber? <laughs> yeah, look, they're calling you old. Not as old as me, Grandpa? True. Okay, sorry, Fuzzy. I have to move you while I use the washroom. You can come back, though. Yeah, big stretch. Taking Ashley's job. Hour three, hydrate or dehydrate peeps. P.S. 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 Come here, Loaf. <laughs> no, Loaf. Only sploff. I have water, at least. Because I want to stream long today, and I'll die without water. Bivouac. 
really know what I'd use it for, but... <laughs> I'm not thinking out of the air up because every time I do, you guys say hashtag ad. Why isn't the sponsor disclosed in the stream? the timer for the attempt or the whole session both how high are we right now i just joined 50 meters Yeah, a couple stories. that though Has anybody gone back and played Breath of the Wild after playing Tears of the Kingdom? How much better is Tears of the Kingdom over Breath of the Wild? Because, like, I enjoyed Breath of the Wild more than I did Tears of the Kingdom. But, like, Tears of the Kingdom is a better game. I just had already done all the exploration I wanted to by the time I played Tears of the Kingdom. So, like, if Tears of the Kingdom... If Breath of the Wild doesn't exist, I think Tears of the Kingdom is a lot more enjoyable. But it's not much better. Well, yeah, Tears of the Kingdom... Yeah, I also feel the tediousness of it because I'm, I just didn't want to do Breath of the Wild again, pretty much. Do you think them is harder? I have a hard time with that because one of my main complaints about Tears of the Kingdom is just that there's too many solutions to any given problem. Yeah. You encounter some sort of challenge, like either in a shrine or whatever. I just did the water temple a couple days ago. And there's like 50 ways to do it and they all work. You get kind of tired of that, I think. It's like, 
it's just, it's too straightforward. Chasing Kingdom is an immersive sim. Having a billion solutions to everything is kind of the idea. Yeah. But it, like, it does make me miss, like... Tyler Princess. Lift object, freeze it, teleport up. Yeah, that's a uh, pretty good solution. Well, one of my favorite parts of Breath of the Wild was actually that island. Where they took all your shit. <laughs> that was a good time. And Tears of the Kingdom does that with some of their shrines, I think, if I'm not wrong. And, like, that's a good time. It is kind of funny, um, playing Tears of the Kingdom after having beaten it. Kind of. And you know, I actually don't feel like I spoiled anything for myself. Like, I saw the major bosses and the end of the game. But like, when I got to the water temple, I was excited to fight the shark again. Cause I was like, dude, I'm gonna absolutely fuck on this shark. I had to fight it so many times. And I did. I absolutely fucked on that shark. And even though I saw the ending, it still didn't tell me anything about Tears of the Kingdom stories. So I still, I'm still getting to experience it how you would normally. I just, pretty much the only difference is that I know what bosses are coming. That's pretty much it. Shark was Defo my least favorite boss? Hmm. I don't know what my least favorite boss was. I liked the shark, but that's because I could, like, two-cycle him. Oh, the moth. The moth was my least favorite boss. Yeah. Moth haters rise up. Okay. I, how, it, it, it. I'll just do this. Hey, cat. So... How are you supposed to do this? Are you going somewhere? There's a rock there. Oh. Well, hold on. You can cramp and jump over? It would be cool if this game recorded stats to see where people fall the most for each mountain, average climb time, etc. That would be cool, yeah. I like random stats in games, they're fun. So you've returned. Oh, come on up. Don't make me pick you up. You're perfectly capable of jumping. If you want up, jump up. I got one hand on... I can't pick you up. Pick her up in a bit, chat. Like, I don't... I don't really get it.
There isn't over anything over there. I don't really want a rope though. I f like I want to save ropes. Okay, cat. You're such a princess. You can't jump like a foot and a half onto my lap. You have to be picked up. You should practice the crab and jump. I don't even know what crab and jump you're really referring to. Well, maybe. Hold on. Maybe I get it. You go over, maybe? No, I don't want to- I actually want to save this rope, chat. Okay, sure. At the risk of falling all the way to the bottom. Fuck it. That's why it's a risk. <laughs> Back to the bottom kitty. We gotta learn the mountain somehow. And we're gonna save every rope we can. No, there's no, there's not multiple routes up. I wonder if Lof likes the sound of the keyboard. Because I think there is, like, she sits on me more when I'm streaming than when I'm editing. I don't know. 
There's something about this that she likes. Oh yeah, sorry. Loaf's a huge fan of chat. You're right. Yeah, might be my voice, yeah. What did I just join in on? Walk. Hey, Spoff. I'm actually going climbing tonight. Going to use some of these techniques for <laughs> myself. Hope they don't kick me out of the gym. Good luck. Don't forget your pickaxe. It's very important. <laughs> Make sure you bring a thermos on the wall and right before you're gonna do a hard jump, just <laughs> whip out a fucking thermos. I thought it was gonna fall. Interesting. What's Loaf's average diet? Nothing but gold flaked salmon. for songs to add to my playlist called Songs for Falling 4,000 Meters. No, I don't have any recommendations. Free Bird? Oh, that's actually a good one. Thanks for the raid, Wolf in the Tank. Madman, thanks for the bits. Spick, if you spam click with both hands when you jump, you will truly begin to peek. They nerfed that. With pickaxes, I don't I don't know how good it is, but yeah, hands is still pretty good, I've noticed. With picks at pickaxes, it seems like your best bet's like the one big swing. Alright, we're back. Significantly better with pickaxes. I'm not spamming though. But like the one swing. I don't know. So, you can't really just. Okay, yeah, backing up a bit's pretty good. Excellent. Alright, let's try it a couple more times. Oh, is 
this rock? Yeah, okay. Yep. Let's do it a third time. What did I just join in on? Walking. Would you ever consider speedrunning this game? Uh, not even a little bit until I've at least beaten everything. Solemn Tempest yesterday. A word of advice the end doesn't have any recovery ice. Uh, there's plenty of the section that doesn't have any recovery ice. I beat the mountain on Saturday. For the love of God, have ropes ready for the end. <laughs> okay! Well, that's why we're doing this! Spam clicking, like, that's so ass. It doesn't work on pickaxes. You have to do full swings. Too much oomph. <laughs> Am I muted? Do you see my mouth moving? Not only am I muted, I'm also a ventriloquist. Gosh, he fell asleep mid climb. Sis, I think you forgot to move your mouth when you were talking right there. Mm, yeah, my bad.
Well, this game... Uh, no, it's not Duval Blind. I take that back. Not this mountain, at least. Because you just didn't, you wouldn't know, you'd never know what part of the ice you landed on. Yeah, not even gonna go there. I'm so extremely terrified right now. I've reached 5,851. There's a jump that has me considering finally breaking free solo and using a rope for the first time in the game. Don't do it. <laughs> just fall. <laughs> yeah, there's way too much horizontal climbing this man. This man needs a bit more verticality. Yeah, it would be, if the horizontal movement was counted, it would be significantly larger. I like this section. Well, honestly, any section where you feckin' go up is pretty alright by me. Yeah, I would recommend this game. Sorry, cat. I've been drinking a lot of fluids. I may have to get up again soon. like a rope. <laughs> oh, Vanessa. This was a coward rope. Oh, maybe not. <laughs> well. Cool. 
Connor, thanks for gifting the sub to Julian. Julian, welcome to being subbed. Biff Ice Axe Spam does work, you just need to time it by doing the full lunge, then repeating that. Yeah, okay. Also, you can chain together up to three crampon jumps during one jump if you're against a wall. That is so scary. There are some true gods of this game that have discovered the stream. No, I'm not that high, Ben. Thanks to the, for the gift sub to Astral Splarf's underwear. Wasn't that guy already subbed? <laughs> or was that a different Astral Spiff's underwear that was already subbed? Or are they subbed again now, yeah? No, 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 Astral Spiff's underwear was subbed, yes, but there was another, there was like, it, it might have been, anyway, there was, there's two underwears subbed. So 27 I almost months. missed my resub. Oh yeah, because you're doing it with Prime. Well, thank you very much, Noah. Um, try to hold it a bit longer. The fewer bathroom breaks I take. The less times I have to disturb Loaf, you know? I don't feel like taking that rope off. There's technically three. Astral Splarf, Spiff, and Spongebob's underwear? That's a different type of thing. Can I post a link to a playlist of every song chat suggested for a falling to 4,000 meters playlist? Yes, you can, I suppose. There, chat. The community falling 4,000 meters playlist. Enjoy.
yeah, this is just like general. Um, God, I don't even know what something Zelda songs. Like Zelda songs to study to or something. All right, big of this. Time for me to go work. Mm -hmm. Good luck. Thank you. Have fun at work. Hopefully they don't make you climb any mountains. Thanks to the 500 bits, Sandpiper. Banned for saying Astral. My mod in this chat. Nice. It's nice to get a ban out of your system every once in a while, chat. <laughs> I'm kidding, but they did deserve it. You've yet to ban anyone? You missed it! I beat you to it! Okay, this is... I often get logged out of chat. That's why I wasn't sure if I was... Modded. It's just like a very random Down Syndrome joke, I guess. I feel like a sickly Victorian child RN. Well, don't die like one. We have modern medicine. I hope you take advantage. They also said astral, which truly doesn't help. But you won't be banned for it. I just don't like it. Yeah, zombie doggy, go have some Taco Bell. That'll cure your Victorian child's illness. Your systems will... <laughs> Something will happen to him. Alright, Loaf. Your spot is not long for the world.
Uh oh. Look, chat, we're at double Richard. <laughs> Don't you love double Richard? Any updates on the dispute? Yeah, four days till I win. All right, thanks for the boost, Richard. You know what's a more peaceful game than this? Twilight Princess. I feel like Twilight Princess is like the FNAF world of Zelda. The more time goes on, the more people realize like, wait a second, it's kind of sweet. Because everybody ripped on it. Like, it got a lot of hate. Just like FNAF World did when it came out. But now, in retrospect, people are like, wow. What a good game. Alright, I gotta use the washroom. Sorry. Was Wind Waker disliked? I haven't played it, but it looks awesome. I also have to, yeah, go to the washroom. I will go piss, girl. <laughs> beep, beep, beep. Sorry, Fuzzy. What if I just, like, like, I can't, I don't know. But she wants to sit on me, so she's gonna probably leave. I don't know. I'll be right back, cat. Cats has, in fact, left. But she'll be back. She does that. Big chair. <sighs> I'll have my loaf blankets ready. I stopped drinking as many fluids, so hopefully I'll last a bit longer this time. Eh. How long have I been streaming? Almost four hours. Now, do we want to get rid of this rope? No. Jump success. I was thinking if this was better or worse than Q10. Hi, Spiff. Hi, chat. How's it going? Worse. I have decided on worse. Why would you say better? Oh. <laughs> Sorry, that sounded so worked up. Why would you say that's be that is better? Q10 on RNG? You know what? As as somebody who's done plenty of speedruns and challenge runs, it is... Now, Q10 had too much RNG. Yes, yes, okay, yes. Yes. 
it's actually sometimes nice to blame it on something besides yourself. When every single failure is 100% your own fault, that sucks. <laughs> Coping scapegoat? Yes. Literally, yes. It's nice to have one, okay? Yeah, exactly. The jester push. I can't believe that terrible RNG happened to me. <laughs> Puff is secretly crying. <laughs> I'm not crying. I'm okay. Just, you know, it's a process. That's all. <laughs> Took a break to cry Seven in the bathroom. Months, let's go. I must cry pretty fast then. Thanks to the seven months. Nia Zoxy. D Valens. Thanks to the new tier one. Oh hey, any uh man. The fact that like nobody's asked me to play the new Poppy Roblox game. I think tells me everything I need to know, but not anything good yet. Synthcat, thanks for the new tier one. Did somebody ask earlier? David asked? Oh. Oh, I didn't see that. That sucks. Can you can you restart? Or like can you Can you fix it, Noah, and keep going? Or do you have to restart? Hey, Spoof, can you play the new Poppy Roblox game? Like, yes. But I'm only gonna play it once it has some decent levels. I've seen someone stand up, walk away, cry for like a perfectly timed five minutes, and then go straight back to work. I did not pee for five minutes. It would have had to be like a 40 second cry. This one you couldn't? That sucks, huh? Well, we're here. This is my favorite wall. <laughs> Strange sentence, but it is my favorite. The old 2000 ice wall. I've heard that the Poppy multiplayer games in, in the worst state it's ever been in. That's like impossible. It launched in an awful state. But I guess it hasn't been touched in a little while. I have heard some complaints from people who are still playing it. But no shot, it's in worse condition than it was at launch. Dude, Project Playtime is still fun. At launch... You know what? I didn't enjoy the bugs that it had at launch. It had madge bugs. Yeah, not fun bugs like Security Breach, so true. That's right. We first try in this shit. What distinguishes a match bug over a fun bug?
Well, at launch, Project had a lot of issues with its lobby making systems. We had a lot of problems getting people in. People would disconnect. Uh, if the killer disconnected, there wasn't a system to switch killers. There were a lot of bugs with, like, accidentally missing people or hitting people when you shouldn't be. So... Bugs... Madge bugs are bugs that remove your ability to play the game. Mm, happy Number bugs one. are ones that expand your ability to play the game. You know? train exit early? I don't know what that is. <laughs> ah, fuck it. Worst thing that happens is I land on my favorite ice wall. Oh, yeah, of course. Oh, that's what you mean by early train. Yeah, 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 yeah. Or getting out of the train early. I thought you meant going into it early. Yes. Yeah, the getting out of the train early was, was fun. But I do understand why it was fixed. Every time he drinks coffee, I can hear that distorted cow meow. What the hell are you talking about? Like Markiplier's most viewed video. No? Yeah. Oh, not good, not good, not good. That's why we're keeping this rope. Can we play on max pixelization? No. No. I was trying to figure out exactly how tall, um, the bulwark was yesterday. So I watched a couple speedruns of it, just to see if they showed the height at the end. They didn't, so I ended up asking Givo. But, uh, point is, like, first place and second place. We're all running the game. Like, the, the screen was a square. And it was... Ah! <laughs> they were both running the game, it looked like, on potatoes. Do I have an Opera GX referral code? No, sorry. <laughs> I use uh, Chrome, not the browser for gamers. Chrome eats your memory, then don't keep it open while you're doing other things. Just don't have study tabs open. Obviously. 
Oh, oh my gosh. No, I just, ah, da. My brain thought it was a rope. I pressed E instead of fucking just grabbing Richard. Best gamer browser is Firefox. I've heard good things about Firefox. My friend from elementary school who was like a long haired vegetarian who only wore shorts. He also only used Firefox. And he'd like uninstall Internet Explorer from the school's computer because he was just, just that guy. No, his name's Ben. Oh yeah, and he didn't even eat vegetables. <laughs> just ate candy. Most browsers currently are JSUT reskins of Chrome. Firefox is one of the I few know. that aren't Chrome in some way. Yeah. <laughs> How'd you get GitHub banned, Give a. So he's not vegan? Uh, no, he never was vegan. But he was technically vegetarian. Didn't eat meat. Just didn't eat vegetables either. The definition of vegetarian is not actually eat vegetables. It's just not meat. What did I just join in on? Walking. What do you eat? I just Six said months. candy and Don't like fumble. bread. And he stayed extremely skinny just because. Yeah, cereal. He ate a lot of cereal. <laughs> Bro was starving. Yeah. I talked to him for the first time in years a couple months ago a little bit. He's uh, doing well. <laughs> he said, gosh, I can't, what's the exact word he used? Something along the lines of hopelessly single. <laughs> Which is kind of funny. He could have just said single. <laughs> he really had to... <laughs> he really had to emphasize just how single he was. <laughs> no, David, you don't understand, like, really single. I can't leak his number, because I don't know what it is. I don't have his phone number. We chatted on Instagram. <laughs> Just fell 4,000 meters? Oh, welcome to the club. I did that earlier. Like absolutely no shot single, relatable. <laughs> Well, it was also, I think, partially in response to the fact that I said that I was getting married. So it was kind of like, a, oh, yeah, yeah, you're getting married. Well, I am really, really single. Ah! What was that? <laughs> what was that sound? No, you're just talking about our lives. I didn't mean to do them like that.
My hungry ass could never climb this mountain. Dude, please come here and eat the mountain for me. Okay, let's not be a stupid dummy butthole. Good. I tend to hit Richard with the ice pick accidentally. <laughs> I that that's got to be one of if not my least favorite message I've seen today. What do you mean your horny ass could not climb this mountain? What the fuck do you mean? I don't even want to know. Don't tell me. Bad news chat, I've acquired the juice. It's the same like pineapple juice that I drink fairly often. Got that nice yellow to it. Oh. Megan, today we added uh, uh, Plink Vibe, and that's my most, that's my favorite most recent Plink variation. Do I need that rope there? Shit. No. Yeah, I'm assuming Plink 5 is Luna. Luna is Plink. Dude, it's Wimdy Chat.
So we gotta. Oh, oops. Got a fair amount of ropes around here, I think. Hello? Oh. <laughs> nice, Wimdy got added, nice. I'll have to... Dude, really? You're... You serious? No. It's not there to there, is it? Gosh, okay. Dude, it is not. I have not done that jump before, but day it worked. I got swinging them pickaxes. So many ropes, ropes have we recovered? Three, I think? That's pretty good. Oh, Megan, uh, me and Paige and Dad are going to your location. <laughs> Uh, for Easter. Yeah, and all of chat's coming too. <laughs> this climb actually the end result is your location Megan. I'm climbing to get you right now as soon as I reach the top You better be ready. I'm there. I'll be there I don't know how you got up here, but Coming to get you Yeah. Can I have a plus 1.9 thousand to the family gathering, please? Dude, I'm gonna tell my kids, oh my gosh, and it's gonna be so accurate that I had to climb this mountain to get to work in the morning. Now that's, and it'll be like, yeah, right, dad. And I'll be like, boy, do I have a video for you. <laughs> 30 hours of VODs, kids. You better watch them. Real killer mo, thanks to the five gift subs. Oh, Vanessa. Damn. True, and they miss if they misbehave, they have to watch the Poppy Chapter 3 any percent video. Oh. No, they have to watch the VODs. Oh. How many clean Ks are there? There's a lot of clean Ks. Don't ask chat, they'll show you all of them eventually. Which is my least favorite video in my opinion? I don't know. 
maybe the chapter two playthrough video, just because it's not that exciting. I just kind of made it because people wanted to see my first time I played Final Chapter 2. Well, that's the thing that's it's interesting. It's like... Like, <laughs> I really have no idea, but... If I have a kid who gets, like, really into a game, you know, like, I will encourage them to pursue greatness within it. Because, I mean, that's, like, kind of what I do. <laughs> it's like, what does that mean? Does that mean I'm gonna be like, you can do it another six hour Tempest Climb? <laughs> Don't give up, child. <laughs> you ever heard of speed running? <laughs> it's a very How interesting tall is this mountain exactly? concept. Exactly three billion kilometers. Seven and a half. What if it's a bad game? Hmm, it's a good question. I don't know. Oh, we're back. Kind of. We must be close to 3k. Yeah. So our best today was... Well, okay. We're still about a thousand underneath our best, actually. Oh, new John FNAF video! No way! John! <laughs> that wasn't John. Oh, yeah. Chat, he showed me this thumbnail. Okay, Epic? I'm gonna uninstall you. Um, He actually he showed me this thumbnail, and he was like, is it a good thumbnail? I was like, oh! Actually, it's just like a thumbnail of mine that did pretty well. The I have a thumbnail that's Freddy's face in the middle with like a white drawn background. The pre-release version of Security Breach video with Freddy with the purple eyes. It's actually quite similar to that thumbnail. Yeah. So I was like, I gave him my blessing. I said, it looks like a great thumbnail, John. And it does. I do like it. But yeah, it's the first John special in a... Couple months, I think. And a person whose name is Astrology? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> They're immediately gone. A 
I can't believe you'd even consider that. That's well, not really up to me to ban people for usernames. Hopefully they never get like an actual bannable username into my chat. It's kind of Twitch's job. They don't always do a great job, but uh... <sighs> they're supposed to. Yeah, most of you are astrology majors because you watch the stream a lot. <laughs> No, it's not a free rope. I placed that. I was here earlier. <laughs> Schlashbacks to Schlatt banning all dream related usernames. It is insane how many there were. That's the crazier part. Case big first stream I could catch. Love the content. Keep up the amazing work. Thank you. Thanks, Spencer. Spent, sir. Thank you for the $5. Spider Prince, thanks to the Prime. Lunar, thanks to the uh, 14 months. That wasn't even all of them. It was just a paste bin of around a hundred or around 10,000. Yeah, it was pretty unreal. Never seen a spiff was taken. <laughs> but uh, I have a different audience than dream I think I have no comment, chat. Bet wisely. I am currently like 3.2. Height, 32, ropes, like 23, but I have like a dozen that are placed further on that will help me. Dude, I can't even go up this rope because of the wind. Bruh. <laughs> what did I just join in on? Walk. That's a good rope. Sadly, I don't think you'll make it. In a few days, Matt Pat is gone from YouTube. That's crazy. Wow. That's great. That is truly crazy. He won't be gone, gone, though. He'll just be gone. Lowercase gone. It is the end of an era, though. Yeah, absolutely. He'll still be in our hearts. I think especially because he wasn't really my childhood. I'm actually just really happy for him. Because as far as I'm concerned, he's had like the absolute perfect YouTuber arc you could ask for. Like, made people's childhoods. 
is a good dude. Has a loving family. And gets to just do whatever. But yeah, yeah, I definitely understand missing him. But, uh, you know, the man made it. Actually, in a very similar way, even though I obviously didn't know Technoblade and didn't even watch much of his stuff, his passing made me really sad because he also was such a good YouTuber and wasn't able to have that sort of, like, you know, retirement that MatPat's having. He deserved it, but he didn't get it. So I was crushed. So then tells me he would have continued streaming and making videos even after retirement? Oh, absolutely. And I mean, like like Matt Pat said, he's he's not gonna disappear. He'll still be doing stuff, but just a little different. Oh chat, these three thousand meter mountain talks always hit so diff. Sigh. You're not immortal. Yeah, yeah, Saskatchewan, yeah. Well, just today, me and Paige have been able to theoretically <laughs> leave the house. I uh, obviously have not left the house. I shoveled yesterday, and it was actually like, oh yeah, like I actually made a trench. It was wild. What did I just join in on? Walkies. <laughs> did you say it's too cold? My trench is gone. <laughs> the wind got it. Oh, the snow plows filled my trench? Do I have to shovel again? Ah. Okay. Well, rip the trench. Oh, Vanessa. <laughs> Thanks for the gift sub to Zai, Connor. Being subbed does absolutely zero things to somebody's mortality. Especially a gift sub.
<laughs> yes, it does. I haven't aged in eight months. Okay, that's a little different. Funny, funny. What's up, Pidge? Alright, to make Paige a spreadsheet. She's doing stuff. <laughs> Did Loaf leave? Did you see her? Whenever I open a new Switch game, I taste test the cartridge and regret it every time. They're still making them taste bad. I licked a cartridge somewhat recently, I think. And yeah, they do still taste bad. Oh my gosh, really? I I think I just did that twice in a row. No, I didn't. No. Addie and I went to a bookstore that had a cat and had no tail, just like Loaf. We could marry them. Thoughts, Paige? <laughs> uh, Loaf's never met a cat she likes, so it might be a bit of a stretch. I think what Loaf might need is a two-tail cat. You know? Making up where she's a little lacking. Might as well just make it a nine-tailed cat while we're at it. Is there actually a kind of cat with two tails? Because people are using words. A nekomata? These don't appear to be real. <laughs> yes, I see. We'll get loaf one of those. <laughs> What's up, page? dare you say they aren't real they aren't in the physical world no no stop 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 neko mata and bakaneko are yokai when a cat gets large or old enough their tail splits in two and they gain magic abilities. 
That's nice. Can't wait to hear TTF butcher the Japanese. Just came back and I see you fall sag. Hate to say it, Chad, this is a path to the bottom. I've just kind of gotten that jump what every time. What if we discovered a planet full of them? <laughs> then I'd be wrong. They are as real as you want them to be. Mm-hmm. This is why the three thousands are the worst. The 3,000 to 4,000 is disgusting. could have wall jumped to it. So I always forget about wall jumping when I'm falling. But I know there's a limit to it. Oh my gosh! Well. Somewhere. <sighs> That's nice, at least. That's a uh, thousand less meters than we have to climb up now. How high are we? 1100 meters. too early. We will win. Just another 3k to PB? Uh, that's 4k to PB, actually.
No hit check. We'll get to the 2000s ice wall fairly soon. I don't think I can put into words how worrying that fall was to my 150k ball. It's a pretty big investment. That Richard. Uh oh. Toggle mode climbing or regular? I don't know. Probably regular if I don't know. It's be easier if I was a mountain goat. <laughs> 90 degrees, 91 degrees. Paige is across the room from me and keeps giving me looks. Almost as distracting as chat. Why does it distract me? Let's hope I don't fall. Paige looks at the camera just like Jim from The Office. No, Paige is more like... When you're trying to give a presentation in class and your friend... <laughs> ...makes a dumb face in the back of the room so you laugh. That's what pages. Ah. Good boy, thanks for the ten months. Stream dead? No, nope. you dead. If you were gone for a while, you might just have to reload. It happens sometimes.
Worked like 45 hours last week and got another day of work left. After tonight, I'm going to sleep for a while. Hell yeah. Dream of climbing the corporate ladder. Sweet corporate ladder dream. There's a velocity limit on mountains. Ah, oh, hey, Richard. I haven't asked you how the kids are today. <laughs> Hope they don't miss you too much. Mecca? Cha? Thanks for the three months. <laughs> the kids are further up the mountain. Yikes. Well, you know, good for them. They made it further than pa. <laughs> Terrible. Terrible. There you go. Here's the 2K ice wall. This is the pleasant part of the climb before the 3K from hell. Thought you already completed this hell? Yeah, just not this, the rest of it. Nothing? Coke, eh? Where'd you go? Did you walk to the gas station? I don't want any milk. Coke Zero? Nasty. Did you walk to the gas station? Oh yeah, okay. Yeah. No, I, I don't want any. Thank you though. Coke Zero's all yours, Paige. This is our Groundhog Day? Yeah. The 3K part. Yeah, chat, you ready for a thousand horizontal meters of climbing? My favorite part, personally. Well, <clears throat> if nothing else, I, I feel myself getting better at this stupid game every day. So there's something. I wonder if you could. It's too bold. What's up, Bean? What? What? I just joined stream and wanted to ask Sorry? how things were going, but all I hear is pain in your voice, so I okay. think I got my answer. Okay. Yeah. Said. Hmm. 
Paige is putting together everything that our photographer needs for the wedding. And, uh, was saddened by the grandparents section, because I don't have any. I have not for many years. It's okay. It's because my parents are really old when they had me. Winning at the dead grandparent. Yeah, okay, Megan just embraces it, I guess. <laughs> You sent your great grandma's 94th birthday. Great grandma? That's so wild. My grandma died at 98. Like, my grandma died at 98. 10 years ago. <laughs> I don't know what that was, bitch. Your great grandma's what? 99. 99, that's impressive. Grandparents are really young in their 60s? Well, yeah, I mean, if you go by like, I don't know, having kids in your late 20s and then your kids have kids in your late 20s, in their late 20s, that puts you like in your 60s, yeah. Your regular grandparent age. But I'm the youngest of my parents, and they're both the youngest of their parents. So that makes their parents real old. Slash dead. No, Megan's uh, three and a half years older than me. She is ancient. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> you thought my grandparents are old. Wait till you find out how old my sister is. Yeah, why did you all think that Megan was younger? Nice! First try! Am I roped currently? No. It's because she's short? That never happens. The brother getting taller than the sister never ever happened. <laughs> what do you mean, still here? I'm 3,000 meters up. Still here. Unless you met the mountain, in which case, yeah, of course. Page got loaf. I hate everything about this game! Back to the ice wall. Oh, 
I actually had a rope there and I took it off. Kind of regret. How did I fall there? Oh yeah, I didn't really get a jump. I was looking for a jump, but I didn't really get it. Yeah, I also want to see the 4,000 Paradise again, yeah. Yeah, so 4,000 to 5,000 is like an ice wall, basically. It's a bit harder than that, but compared- and it's also- it's like straight up ice wall. So, it, uh, it feels really, really good to get there. Like, I was... Definitely considering, uh, quitting during... The 3000s? When I was kind of stuck there. But once I passed it and saw four to five thousand, it just felt so good that uh, I decided to finish pretty much. It's like I was always going to finish, but now I'm okay with grinding it now, I guess. I mean. You know what height you are by looking down and, um... Oh, no, no, no. You know which height you are by falling and counting the s number of seconds that it takes for you to hit the ground. Then you can know how high you were. You also have a whatever eater. Barometer. Something eater. Uh, but I like the falling better. Yeah, it's a favorite of mine. <laughs> Was Loaf climbing up the computer? Huh? Was Loaf climbing up the computer? Oh, she knows better than that with me. Altimeter? Altimeter? due to gravity in this game is the same as in real life? No. I don't. That's an insane thing to ask a Twitch streamer. You know I didn't know that. I guess you're asking me to theorize. I don't think so. <laughs> but you know I'm not smart enough to answer that. Thankfully, this jump's very safe. I'm actively studying physics. Okay, watch a clip and tell us. 
You're actively studying physics? I'm passively studying physics. <laughs> I'm assertively studying physics? Whoa. The developer's, like, active in the speedrun Discord, I think. Damn, we high. So true. I've been streaming five hours. Ah. <sighs> Grab something you stuh uh, the ice wall. <laughs> five hours and we haven't reached the promised land. I just wanna see the promised land. <laughs> Thing is, like, I feel myself getting a lot better at the game, but to do so many jumps without mistakes is uh, gonna take getting really better at the game. It's gonna have to become second nature. I'm going to have to become the game. Yes, it is like Celeste with 3D. It's nothing like the pot big game. Fan. Good luck climbing big rock. Meow. Thanks, Mr. Television. Thanks for five dollars. Glad you enjoy. I will need the luck for the rock. I do have to become the peak of your yeah. So the stream schedule this week is uh, peaks of your peaks of your peaks of your, unless I finish. I, what did I just join in on? Walk want to PB today. I've already been streaming for as long, often as long as I stream. Period. But I, I'm unrelenting for at least a little while. Yeah, I do have things in mind after I beat Pigs of VR. I'm gonna do backroom speedrunning and practice for uh, another FNAF marathon. And to work on the GTFO videos. Subs. Thank you very much. Chat, if you got the gift sub, say thank you for the generosity. <laughs> this character must get hit by so many G's. That's funny. I haven't considered that. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I think I've PB'd every stream. 
And if I keep PVing, then it is inevitable that I will reach the top. Simply inescapable. David Naked Man, it's my birthday, Spiff. You have to PB or I won't age. That's not such a, such a bad thing, is it? Because if you were immortal, then you might be able to play Silk Song one day. When it comes out in a couple centuries. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> no negative immortality. Only the happiness. Yeah, this is where I fell most recently. I got a rope here. Oh. The apocalypse just happened. Who are you taking with you? Paige or Loaf? Well, here's the thing. I can eat loaf. I can't eat page. Because that would be cannibalism. The combination of the upset faces from chat and Paige is incredible. Huh? No, 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 no. <laughs> I love soup. <laughs> it's true, I probably would go for a soup. I'm really not actually weighing the caloric benefits of eating page or loaf. I just said it <laughs> for the bit. I've done this before, thank you. Have a video where he talks about eating a horse. Why? What what does that video entail? Cause like obviously you could eat a horse, but like what what question is he answering? If you really could be hungry enough to eat a horse, dude, no shot. I mean, like, if you're eating the whole thing, yeah, no shot. If 
Personally, I have never been hungry enough to eat a horse. <laughs> Maybe a pony. <laughs> true, true. back to and why are we talking about eating horses is the climb getting to you well the climb started getting to me a long time ago Okay, where are you supposed to go from here? It's like I've forgotten, and I just gotta go for this insane Hail Mary jump. <laughs> what the fuck? What am I supposed to do there? Oh no! Oh, I was- if I missed this ice wall, it was over. I was done for the day. <laughs> okay, we carry on. This jump- this- this fall is fine, Travis. Nice wall, it's underneath. Why didn't I rope to check? I don't rope. Oh, actually, I've done that jump before. Can I get a compilation of your faces every time you fall? Sure, Noah, you can make it. Why don't you 3D print my face? Does your game let you check the altimeter while falling? You know, that's something I haven't tested. Usually while I'm in the while I fall, I'm in the process of attempting to stop my fall, but Good question, I guess. All right, dude, Lord. You can't rope while falling, no. There's a certain speed that doesn't let you rope anymore. Oh, there's an icicle right here. Oh, this is the next thing. Oh. Yeah. There we go. This is payback for saying Solemn Tempest isn't a cool name. It still isn't. It's just not fitting for this, like, difficulty Spike isn't even a good word for it. The the abandoning of the learning curve and jumping to the learning cliff. I saw this uh, Minecraft meme meant to joke about Dark Souls. And it like gives you a sword and it was like, press left click to swing your sword. And then it lets you kill a bat. And then it's like, good, now try for yourself. And he enters a room with like 50 million ender dragons. That's what this climb is. The bulwark is a bat. And this is 50 million ender dragons.
Oh, I'm glad you like the rain room videos. Metpath said that it's illegal to eat, sell, or produce horse meat with the intention of selling at least in the U.S. This is because horse meat is highly toxic in the U.S. and neighboring countries. This is because of all the chemicals they inject for horse races and such. There. That's crazy. Hmm. Horse got like that. Um. That xenomorph acid blood. You should do a research paper on the recreation of real life phobias inside of video games. I don't know what she said, but yes. Yeah, YouTube essay vibe? Yeah. I'm not too far off that. You could do it on Sub Subnautica. How Subnautica recreates whatever that long word that is scared of deep water. It's like Thalassa something, I think. Over where I live, horse meat is so common a factory exceedingly into lasagna a while ago. Okay, I'm sorry, what? Where I live, horse meat is so common, a factory accidentally it into a lasagna a while ago. That's odd. Hopefully the lasagna didn't become poisonous. Fire Nard, are you still in chat? I had one more comment about your uh, animation you sent that I forgot to mention. No, don't think so. Knock! Don't black out! Oh my god. I hate that section. Like, why you gotta fucking knock? Black out! <laughs> Ugh. That's so annoying to black out there. No, I don't think the re react YouTuber has. I mean, no, I don't think he's responded to my comment. <sighs> oh. <laughs> yeah, really? You fell like two feet, bro. Relax. Yeah, you can get knocked out and not slide off.
Mental check? I mentally want to be big. Hasn't happened. You know, I might tell Connor that we can pretty much skip this day. <laughs> you know, we actually had a seven hour day in the Lethal Company video that made up like a minute and a half of the video. It's probably gonna be the case with this one. do this part get out of here you have to know that if I fall I have to redo parts that's gotta just be a troll message <laughs> just fall upwards dude true <laughs> We've looped back around to Zelda or to. I feel like I've heard this song already on this playlist. I know OBS is popular and free, but does it still work if you go full time? No, as soon as OBS detects that you make money, it shuts itself down. Yeah, like pretty much every streamer I know still uses OBS. There is no alternative. It's probably what makes it so great. It's free and and it doesn't actually shut off when you start making money. <laughs> free to play streamers only, yeah. Damn. It's looping? Alright, we'll switch it up. Yeah, I use Streamlabs. It's the same thing. Streamlabs is a reskinned OBS. And I only still use it because I'm used to it. No other reason. OBS gets new features first because Streamlabs just copies OBS. So, I'd always recommend OBS. Little Nightmares soundtrack, I it does have some bangers, but like it's got some real not bangers. But hey, maybe it's time for Little Nightmares. Yeah. Let's try it.
Best Little Nightmare music compilation. Sure. Doesn't fit to be honest. It's not bad. I think the loneliness that little nightmares goes for fits. But uh obviously they're very different games. Oh close to my PB. Here's the deal. I am entering the worst part of the climb. The next 1,000 meters are insanely brutal. If we pass them, we will be in a position to PB. But it is just a very, very brutal 1,000 meters. Very little to catch you. I think we should do the Rock and Stone soundtrack. There's one specific Little Nightmares song I want to hear. And it will come up, so... Hey, yeah, is there a Sisyphus soundtrack? Besides the Ultra Kill Sisyphus song? I could get to the lower one. What is this? This has got to be very little nightmares.
Damn. Okay. Our three years will remember this place. Am I gonna make a video on Plinks of <laughs> Peaks of Yar? Three, actually. <laughs> it's just like hot dog thing. <laughs> goes by many names, but if it were a crocs, I'd call it the Jagged Maw. Yeah, it is nasty. It's my birthday today, so have a good stream, Seth. That's a couple of birthdays. Yarkuda. Icy Yarkuda. Thanks for the four months. Hope you have a good birthday. I don't know if Crux is on this. Because in the game, nobody's climbed it. So it's got no hard parts. The whole thing is a Crux. I don't need that rope. It's almost too bad it's there. True, nobody's climbed it and lived. True. There are a couple of Richards who are, uh... Pretty high up there. So I'd take out that rope, this one, hell no, this is a incredibly necessary rope.
3,200 meters. Ah, oh, yeah, this is also a rope worthy jump. It's a two in one rope. Almost more than that. This music is uh, not very calming, but I don't really mind that. What did I just join in on? Walking. here. Close mine to the top? Not halfway. Chill, chill, chill. Not the time, not the time. Musical timing is not going well. <laughs> A fall drink then would have been... A bit more fitting. Too bad I never fall, except when I do. <clears throat> oh, shoot. This is it. This is where I fell last time. Gonna rope here. Kinda worried because there's a rope right after. We'll see. Yeah. This jump sucks. Uh, we're back to like, oh, no, we're actually, wait, wait, no, 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 we're not, no, 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 this is the last big fall we had.
Yeah, I think we should be okay here. No, this isn't new PB. It's not even the best we've done today. Oh, wow. Jeez, I unroped without even realizing. Chad, do you feel tension? Something about this feels tense. Can't quite put my finger on it. We've been on this jump a few times today. It's not uh, not the first time I've fallen off that today. How far did I fall? A couple hundred meters. It was actually a fall off of a recovery, I think, that did us in last time. I don't know. You're probably right, yeah. Thank you. This is my favorite Little Nightmares song. If you've watched my videos, you might actually recognize that I've used it a few times. types of jumps are literally any jump where you know that if you fall the bottom of the fucking mountain awaits you.
Okay, I don't know what you mean. I know I should use the wind for this one. So the wind's... No, the wind's blowing the other way. So Chad, this is now the start of the bad part, part two. <laughs> So congrats to us, we made it halfway through the bad part. This is from Little Nightmares 1. from one or DLC I don't know I haven't seen Dune 2 actually me and Paige had literally booked tickets to go and the theater closed because of the snow Too bad. It very much makes sense. No employees would have been able to get there, but we were gonna walk. But obviously, uh, yeah, we would have been walking to an empty theater. We at least really got popcorn. No, we didn't go. So, oh, we'll probably go in the next week. <laughs> Whatever. There we go. No, I haven't fallen to the bottom. Ah. During this prediction, I have fallen to... 1,000 meters. That was unfortunate.
Ah, uh, oh shoot. Aging 10 years watching this, yeah. Yeah, I fell like, I don't know, 400 meters. break your arms catching yourself like that in real life? Yeah, you'd tear them off. Unless you're Scottish, of course, like this guy is. True, not if you stretch before going into a strenuous activity. That is so right. Make your muscles nice and limber, like uh, Miss Incredible. This is incredible. Sorry. Scotland forever. This is the big jump. There goes another 10 years, yeah. At least we have that ice cliff under us. We don't have the ice cliff under us where I fell at my best today. Ever take breaks? Sometimes I am stream. But no, I don't usually take breaks while I'm streaming. I go to the bathroom. I'm going VIP to June 2, which means we get to eat and drink anything one hour before the movie starts and during the movie, and the movie is like almost three hours. So big worth. Oh yeah. Eat ten pounds of M&Ms. Sounds pretty big worth. I'm a big M&M's in the popcorn, er. It's real shit. <laughs> the 
mouth and like <laughs> butter soaked M and M's. I like to microwave my M and M's and then just drink them. this I haven't used bivouac no if we fall again I'm taking that rope back Bivouac just lets you close the game. Ah, oh my gosh. Wait, wait, wait. No, dude, there was a frame. Oh my gosh. That would have been clutch as shit. That would have been sick. Oh, it's okay, it's okay, it's not long. You can get back there pretty fast. Yeah, Bivouac's a sleeping bay, yeah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Why Spiff has gotta go. Like said, 15 months throw a jump. You only get a kiss at 16 months. Am I still accepting emote submissions? Yeah. Well, that's a mood change. Oh, oh, oh. change there we go I'm really becoming the climber like he is me I feel him Dude, the wind actually makes a huge difference. I can feel just how slow I was with no wind. It's like the one ha handy wind jump. Yeah, wind is terrible, but there it's kind of nice actually. Oh, 
Ah. Ah, I'm losing it. <laughs> Use the bathroom one last time, and then we got another good hour of attempts to get up to PB. We've made very good, very good skill progress. <laughs> I'll be back. Now that Spiff is gone, we can all kiss each other. Smooch's chat. Blam. Okay. Okay. Hour six. Please remember to hydrate and take your meds if necessary. Mountain moment. Guess have a good time while I was gone. Get a boom shakalaka. Boom mm, shakalaka. Whoa. Bro. Bro. What the hell was that? That was a speedrunner jump right there. Sheesh. Where's my towel?
I'm kind of chilly. No, I don't have the deflated seahorse. Whew. It died e like a, e at least a year ago. Connor, I think I got this FUD. As in, I'll make a montage out of it. Oh my gosh, I fell there before. Ah, well, let's get back to the fucking ice path, shall we? Keep going. It's PB today. It happened three hours in. That's nice car. <clears throat> Is there adamantite pickaxes? They have insane durability. Finally caught a stream that wasn't at the very end. I guess not. Thanks, Super Squishy. Nope. We still haven't PB'd, therefore... We push on... You're so right.
That's the wrong button. Hmm. Shock yourself, buddy. Oh, whoops. Yeah, close one. We are roped there, though. So it's not a biggie. It was here, not there. I think I can still do this jump with this rope. Good. Remember how bouncy and happy Spork was at the beginning of the stream? I'm not sad. I'm just tired. <laughs> Aren't we all? <laughs> yeah. You get tired after doing stuff for a long time. What's new? Look at you, so young and happy. Where did the years go? Yeah, me at the start of the stream versus now. So true. So true. Thanks for the gift sub, and Sensel. Thank you. Seem to be more gray. <laughs> oh yeah, I lower my saturation part way through the stream. I got that climbing sickness. Dude, I was hanging like Richard for a second, true.
Yep, I think so. I know there's some people that only listen to my streams. And when I get quiet and focusy, they can only imagine what's actually going on. But I mean, they'd know if I fell. The soft chk, chk of the rocks would stop. Yeah, a lot of people mostly listen and just, I mean, that's how I treat streams. I like ropes. <laughs> They make me feel safe. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, hmm? so... Oh, we're not quite. We're almost... I guess really just past this rope is the highest I got today. For catastrophically failing somewhere along this uh, terrible line. Probably right here, actually. Yep. <laughs> this jump. Lessons learned. Only took four hours to get back here. Good thing I've improved. It's not a PB though. PB on the day. Not a PB. Bacon Sun scale of 1 to 10. How bad do you want to be banned? Or back sun, <laughs> not bacon sun. This is not where I was an hour ago. You just saw a mountain and decided to be a smart ass. I know I have to jump for it. I'm waiting for the right moment. <laughs> Please don't ban me. I won't.
<laughs> I'm going mad with power. Yeah, it's literally. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Every once in a while, when I see the same message for the 70th, 80th time, somebody has to be made into an example. Okay, with the one person I banned this stream, it had nothing to do with me being in a bad mood. They were being a bad chatter. Naughty, naughty chatter. How many Plinks until it's annoying? Oh, I don't mind seeing Plinks, actually. <laughs> I don't care anymore. <laughs> But actually, though, where am I supposed to be going here? Oh, you know what? It's definitely a case of... Yep, there it is. Yep, it's always that. This one, too? There it is. Classic peaks of your moment. She yoring on my peak till I plank. <laughs> A wild flock of Richards. No, it's, it's the rest of his family.
Here it comes! Open. Paige, you're actually dancing in tune with the music in my <laughs> headphones right now. Keep it up. Good job, Paige. Paige just successfully sold the couch. <laughs> R.I.P. to the bachelor couch. What am happening? I'm in make a focus mode. Make a focus mode. What a fucking nerd. <laughs> This music really is avalanche.mp3. Oh shit! <laughs> if you haven't noticed chat, this is the promised land. As, you know, unwelcoming as it may initially seem. Wrong hotkey. You got this Thank you. It's the promised land because it's up. It's not horizontal. It's vertical mountain climbing. For once in this god forsaken mountain's existence. Oh, maybe I didn't need that rope. Now nah, I'll keep it. No. Not PB. Not yet.
Keep holding on, believers. Yes. Hey, believers. We're getting there.
What a classic Richard moment. Who's back? Richard's back. I remember the jump that I failed on, so... Don't worry about checking height. Uh, I, I will know. That's PV. Right? Did I look at it wrong? Oh no. Yeah. Sorry, it's not. Sorry. I'm. Nah. Uh, I'm joshing you. I've been playing this game too long. <laughs> Oh my god, I see it. I see it. I see it. I see where I fell.
Ah. No. No five kilometer fall yet. Believer, that was exactly where he fell before. Not exactly. I fell one rock over. <laughs> Necessary rope. That's uh, not a good jump. Not with the wind and the rocks. But the rocks are less of a factor than you might think. I say that as they've been things to knock me off. But they're a stressor that makes me miss other things.
Dude, I heard a phantom rope top out there. I've been playing this game for seven hours straight. I need to write a mission statement, what should it be? I'm going to climb this fucking mountain. Crazy blast of wind there. Interesting. You go down. That's how. Yes. I love this relationship we have, Richard. I ride you, and you never let me down. Doesn't matter if Paige is in the room, nothing I said would have been changed.
little late, aren't I? Well, whatever. Give it up for hour 7. Remember to hydrate. I love giving money. Thanks for the three months. Ashley, thanks for the bits. Dex Blazer, thanks to the new tier one. Stub Skill, thanks to the Prime. Sour Cookie, thanks to the Prime. Let's, 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 <laughs> let's PB, shall we? Dude, my fingers are like, in pain. Almost a year Dino Dance. Keep fighting the pain. Almost there. Well, I still want to go beyond as well. But yeah. Pickaxes are so much more awkward than these hands when going for jumps like that. I am going to bet good luck on the rest of the climb.
can't hold me down. Fucking boulders. There you go. Now we go further beyond. Okay, let's save ourselves, let's save ourselves, let's save ourselves. Twitch has not been giving me notifications. Glad to finally catch a stream. Whoa! Whoa! PBED. Well, see you Thursday. Congrats on the PB. Seven hours to go about a hundred meters further and then fall. You tried Spig Flower. It's the pickaxes. They don't grab things once they're sliding. <sighs> Be back Thursday. What did I just join in on? Walkies. Seven hours. My fingers hurt. And perhaps we can beat it Thursday. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, that's Sisyphus timer. <laughs> uh, I can't believe the ice didn't grab there. I was going to bivouac. Look at a bivouac to 500 meters. My pinky is swollen. All right. Yeah, I'm also shocked. Can you not reload a save? What save? Breaking news. Local Let's Player Astral Dave suffers greatly after tragic loss. What save? Okay. We'll beat it Thursday. <laughs> what a clip. Good night, chat. I'm sending you to the void. See you later. Thanks for all the subs, resubs, bits. Have a good sleep.